Yeah. So the uh, stuff that we learned about the chest so far is that they laugh at you and they uh, obfuscate the locks with our cane lock. Mm -hmm. It's a magic mouth. I think I need to do that. Uh, <laughs> 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 magic mouth. cane lock. And then obviously the disintegration ray that fires off once per round. I'm trying to remember how you get rid of arcane lock. Knock. knock. It is knock. Knock will well, suppress it. will suppress it for 10, ten minutes. minutes. Okay. Does it's anybody... I'm sorry, what? Knock is not a ritual. It's not a ritual. There are very few rituals. <laughs> okay. So, back to the question I thought I asked. Does anybody here have knock as one of their uh, sorcerer spells? Nope. I didn't <clears> think so. The wizard has it, but he's busy. Oh, yeah. we do it only work eight hours a day. I mean, you yeah. go, yeah. oh, I was yeah. gonna say eight hours a day. It's gonna take nine months. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's not. I think it's, <laughs> I think it's ninety days. Oh, and then uh, you're gonna have to take a break for mating season. So I mean, that's gonna add another month, right? <laughs> <laughs> only work eight hours a day. What is communist Russia? <laughs> Wait, maybe you could just work through mating season. Yeah. I don't think the wizard would care. Yeah. <laughs> I sent the number to you. Oh, in a second? So uh, I'm just going to look it up on my history. I'm not saying, yeah. I also yeah, had 28 some... does not unlock your chest. 28 does not unlock your chest. Because of the arcane lock, as you were trying to think, you realize that oh, the okay. lock itself keeps like creating illusions and trying to trick you, and gotcha. so it's the arcane lock that's bumping. Oh, so those up. aren't those There's, aren't spells. Those are wizard spells. So just looking at the make of the lock, mm -hmm. like you know it should be a twenty something actual spells. It's a twenty those are pretty good lock, mm -hmm. right? but you can do twenty locks. But it's got magic on it that makes it a thirty mm -hmm. lock. Mm -hmm. Three three months, ninety two days. Oh, that's awesome. Rounded up by a day. <laughs> like, it's like 92.43. So <laughs> that's not including my 92 days of straight work. Yes. Like, mm. 92 days of hours. 92 days of 8 hour days. 92 8 hour days. Oh. Costing uh, 41,500 gold. Second? <laughs> <laughs> but the lich is paying, paying for it. So. Oh, okay. okay. <laughs> <laughs> you work for him and he pays your expenses. I still need to go back and look at the video where you make comments. I still haven't done that yet. <laughs> I put timestamps and everything. How much money are you spending? <laughs> That was just the one where you said you, where you said you're taking my shield. I, that's what I want to do. <laughs> <want to. laughs> and also, those are only uh, fifth level and below. Right, right, right. There is. You have to come back for sixth level. There's almost <laughs> always. I think there's an almost even number of spells above fifth level. Oh yeah, another thing. Uh, you and I went over uh, summoning the nope ropes if we ever encounter the angels again. Because they, because they only have single target damage. Oh mm -hmm. right, right, right. They'll have to kill them one at a time. Yeah. Yep. And that's an average, but it's a, it's what? an average of basically eight points of damage per note broke that hits. I want to turn into poison, and then it's one. Yeah. Ah. <laughs> yep. Mostly they are angelic, so it's possibly they are. <laughs> I understand they generally don't kill things, they usually attack to subdue. They beat you into submission and then give their message and go Unless away. you're a blasphemer. Unless <laughs> you're a blasphemer. Unless you're trying to seal off all of their followers from their god. That, that might take them off enough to use lethal force. So basically they're doing a, they're doing a, the mafia thing. You do what we say, we break the legs. <laughs> And you got you got a couple clerics so they heal you, so it's okay. <laughs> uh, okay. Uh, so how are we gonna open the chest? Uh, we're gonna get someone with a knock spell. Uh, did are we all caught up on XP? No, you didn't get the XP from yeah, from all the the, the uh, 
both the rooms because we haven't we haven't rested yet. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's oh yeah, and this is the same group that has changed. Yep. So we yeah, know that, that that is the total scope is eight hundred and thirty hours. Yeah, and I subtracted out the chest because up here you get this point you're gonna have to go get some other people. So I was curious if one of the guys is not all of them, then I could just switch out it. But I wasn't using for a knock spot. Right, well you haven't had a long rest, so um, also I think you did have a short rest uh, after you killed all the humans in the other room. But then you came here and fought the ogres after the short rest. So we're gonna go get the Natsuko guy? Might as well. And also, whoever knows Mage Hands. And more Mage Hands. <laughs> mage Hands I have. Yeah, I do Mage Hands on the Alright, uh, well the wizard should be well rested. So, uh, you'll have as many knock spells as you need to do to make the attempt break. Right? Uh, I mean, yeah, I think we go get the knock guy. And then we'll bring in Grit as well. Where, where is everybody? Grit, is Grit the big unlocker? <laughs> Good, plus 14 in this is the fun thing. Oh, oh yeah. So, <laughs> uh, Grit might be a short and huge spell slot. But uh, he won't need any spells, only the wizard will need spells. Oh, yeah, 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 the, the chair is already set up. Oops. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, okay, so let's get the uh, wizard. I have 16 on you. And great. Did you bring food? Yeah, I did. Oh, okay, that's fine. Oh, you know, I posted here, it was kind of open. Though. <laughs> um, Grit was going to post the, oh that's the, Grit was, uh, I posted, uh, the Grit was going to open the chest that night because I got Grit and it's growing my stuff again. <laughs> that's easy to do. So the wizard has done a long rest? Yeah. I'm going to get to erase all of these. So you have 14 attempts? To get a 20? <laughs> so you you have 14 10 minute increments. So okay, he has a hundred he has hundred and forty minutes. So <laughs> just yeah. just over okay. twenty. Oh, wait. Okay. I need to get a twenty with a with an arcane mock uh, assist. With a yes. plus fourteen. Yes. Okay, I do it. And you have ten minutes to do each one. But you'll have to mage hand in order to keep the disintegration rate missing. Okay. Alright, okay. Major. Do you read Elvis? Uh, yes, I think. <laughs> if not, I'm going to burn another yeah, one spell faces. and cast no, Comprehend Languages. Oh, that's, that's right. That was the other thing we were doing. was allowing yeah. me to rest so I can get that it spell. If you just. If, what? If you can fetch the wizard beforehand, um, the wizard yeah, knows how to Alright, so yeah, that's what you got here. Yeah, and you're just standing around watching them open chests now, so or kind of try to open chests. <laughs> so uh, you'll have to throw that as mage hand as well. We just need a comprehend languages and a knock from the If you want to read the um, yeah, description, yeah. it just says raid leader your one equipment chest, no unauthorized access. Hmm. So that may help. <laughs> How very James actually would <laughs> I'm assuming the next one says two. Yeah. The next one says three. Uh-huh. <laughs> So, uh, because you have to do it under duress, uh, you will actually have to roll rather than just say you did it. Okay. Well, I treat everything as a 10. So, you'll get a 24 on your first attempt. Yes. Oh, yeah. You have more chance. I just do it. Okay. You're done. But <laughs> <laughs> so we need to bring a spell slot. So, yeah. Alright. So, uh, we can go ahead and uh, do the experience now. You had to add two guys though, so. Um, one. Actually, I'm just gonna take this. 
And you're not going to make it $1,200. <laughs> so great, and the wizard get twelve hundred experience for helping out. That's what they get just for helping out. Yeah, well, there are yeah. nine level ten uh, traps there. That you yeah. Buy yeah, so twelve hundred. Um, so that means uh, everybody else here besides great and the wizard gets um, a total of six thousand seventy four. For all the fighting that you've done up to this point. And their share of the tracks. I am just under 2,000 shy of 13 foot. So 6074, correct? Yes. Mm -hmm. That's for uh, Root Rot. Yes. If Root Rot hasn't leveled by now, he should. <laughs> <laughs> I think he was just barely short last time. Yeah. But the wizard might be. With just the 1200? Yeah, he was damn close last time. Mm -hmm. Although I think he's going to be just even more closer. <laughs> uh, I'm close. Okay, now we need to know what's in the chest, though. So. Also, yes, we do. walking around trying to find any other elvish signs while the spell is up. Anything oh, okay. meaningful? Yeah, now all of the things are like are labeled with the unit name on the right, uh, the empty uh, racks and whatnot. Empty yeah. racks. Yeah, any uh, and then you know, any one of those, Remember the Titan things above the door to the stairs yeah. with fingerprints on. <laughs> Some other phrase. That <laughs> uh, I do have a question concerning yeah. the administrative uh, papers and whatnot. Once you're done. I see, yeah, whenever you're ready. No, nothing here. What, uh, nothing else of uh, your needs. Okay. Uh, before you jump into the magic items, then let's go over the stuff that the ogres, minotaurs, dwarves, humans, and halflings had. Was any of that magical? No. No. It's just mundane items. Mm -hmm. Okay, though. 85,000 to get to 11. Mm -hmm. And we would just leave that for everybody so else to use. Uh, it's just just 35,000 is 11. And with the stuff that they're no, no, carrying, the Ula Kai okay. could use then. Sure. Because it's large size by fur correctly, so. Mm -hmm. Yes, that's right. A bunch of large things. All right. Were they wearing armor, or did they just have shields and weapons? Uh, they had hide armor, but nothing fancy. Uh, maybe, maybe the trolls could use it, I don't know. Maybe they know a guy. Maybe they know a guy. Um, Alright, but you collect up all that stuff. Uh, oh, yeah, and uh, collecting up skulls. What I is... They wear over skulls, you don't have those. Oh, your skull, new skull. Yep. Well, uh, Nail Skull needs a helmet too. Mm -hmm. He's jealous of uh, Lockjaw's... Fire giant hell. <laughs> um, um, six level. You get six at fourteen thousand. So it doesn't until twenty five. So he's with that. Yeah, the magic. Hand. All right. Yeah, he uh, that. Cool. He, each uh, chest had a uh, a purple set of elven chainmail. So you got three more sets of elven chainmail. Purple elven chainmail. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Why would they wear red when they're sneaking around? Uh, and uh, goggles of night. Goggles. Goggles. Yeah, but it gives you 120 foot dark vision. Mm -hmm. Is it is it also allowed to penetrate uh, magical darkness? No. Mm -hmm. And does that one require a tuning? Uh, I don't think either one of those requires tuning. Okay, that's very useful All because right. that means you can pass them around. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And you just have three more people that you can't hear in front of you. Uh, Is okay. it three sets one? Uh huh, three sets. Sweet! Sounds like a good thing for an archer. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, I'll say archer, yes. Grits is another one I'm thinking. Maybe another one goes to Nate Pop. Oh, great. Because uh, I can shoot things from very far away. Oh, yeah, you can also shoot things from very far away. He's also he one of the fastest after. people yeah. in, in the party, too. So. Well, obviously, Bane Pop and. With a. Uh, Cracker, Jawbreaker yeah. quickly catching up. Oh, yeah, yeah. he's gonna spat him. Yeah. I'm gonna need to take a feat to get. Yeah, he's still gonna pass me. Yeah. Okay, so. Yeah. Alright, so three suits of purple elven chain, three goggles of night. Uh huh. And then uh, the first one had a plus two short sword and a plus one hand crossbow. Plus two short sword. Hand crossbow. 
Okay, they're all short, short in crossbow, so why don't I just do them in? Plus one in crossbow? Two plus, I mean, I'm sorry, a plus two short sword and three, and two more plus three short swords. Plus three short swords. So two plus two, a plus three, and a plus three short sword. Okay. I can't send that any more awkward. <laughs> okay. And each one has a hand crossbow, plus one, plus one, and plus two. Okay, so two plus ones and one plus two. Okay. And then a hat of disguise. Ooh, that's actually very handy. I don't know what you do that, but you'll think something. We can pretend uh, that. That requires a two minute. <laughs> hat of disguise. Hat of disguise requires two, two minutes. Okay. And then also a gym of scene. Ooh. Does that one require a two minute? Yes, it does. Damn it. Well, then again, I keep going back. True sight. I was about to say, true sight is the big thing. Yeah. yeah. It's on that short range. Short swords are monk weapons. Short swords are they? Yeah. Ooh. And then uh, the third one is a liar of the demon web pits. Which works just like a horn of Valhalla, but it summons the spirits of drought. Okay. Just... Now we have bronze. We have the drum. And the Yeah, and the liar. Uh, it requires two minutes, I'm assuming two? Yep, that was just a two minutes. Okay, it's the horn of... It's the liar of demon web pits. But liar... <laughs> <laughs> it's just like a horn of Valhalla, except it summons drow. And that is on page 175 in the music. Okay, I was going to say, is it a long use? No, it's just like a bronze horn of Valhalla. Page again? 175. 175. Uh, but you never send the goblins. Why the hell send the draft? Do they have ranged weapons? We could leave it here for more time. For the quick back end. No, no, they just, they're, they're just uh, two man fire guys. Well, we, we can talk about that, yeah. Well, we did not require any two minutes yet. That could easily be done. Do the drums require two minutes? Yep. No. No. Okay. So. We got to leave the drums, or just... Right, in case of emergency, bang on this drum. Watch it. There you go! Exactly, <laughs> yeah! Got one more green and goes to come out. Uh... Uh... There were pop goblins. Or the orcs. I heard that you made a mistake a long time ago in the campaign to do me here. We were we're always making mistakes. Only, and only for uh, our benefit. <laughs> it won't make any difference in anything. Uh, but when the cofame got cracked by Lucky, and it reabsorbed the uh, red shirt who happened to be there. Um, it should have also transported back to the red shirt's place of birth, which was just somewhere in the mountain where you were at the time. And then you would have to go through the hassle of moving it back to the Legisthorne. Oh, uh, okay. Doesn't affect anything. <laughs> just it, forgot to tell you. Then they come and you disappeared, but then you found it. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. like it would have taken another 30 minutes. Yeah. <laughs> okay, uh, so so far we got three suits of purple. But it doesn't get transported back to uh, the place of birth when you add the spirit using the magic weapon. Cool, good. So. But if it were to return, it would go back to. Or it doesn't return unless it adds a new person. Unless it's, it's broken. Yeah. <laughs> then it goes back to the place of birth of whoever it absorbed the initial. Okay, so if it has multiple. No, it's no, whoever is absorbed next. Because when it cracks, all those people are oh, okay. And it's whoever it absorbs next. Nice. Okay, gotcha. All right. So, okay. Yeah. I'll say, yeah, that. I'll say, remember that happened when we first encountered it then. Because we took it straight from that ball. So, no, oh. it got transported back. I mean, you went oh, to return home right. and found that they had already located it. I. I yeah, see, remember that part. Part. <laughs> but the it's, second it's, time, it's, so much time we stuff. forgot. <laughs> that it okay. But since it was at Ledge Mountain, it just got transported to some hovel somewhere where this redshirt was born, and then moved back to the original hovel. All right. Okay. okay. So, anything else yeah. after that? No, that's it. I don't know. All right. Things in now, when it comes to the purple goblin chain, uh, what does that do? In the goblin chain, it, uh, you know, it's plus one chain. Well, sure. It's a plus one oh, chain. Sure. And it um, right. confers uh, the ability, the you know, or efficiency to whoever wears it. So you can, even a sorcerer can wear a chain shirt, uh, an elven chain, because it gives him proficiency using the armor. 
but it doesn't, no it, it doesn't prevent you from having the arcane spell failure. Nope. Nope. I mean, yeah, because it gives you the proficiency automatically, it doesn't cause any arcane spell failure. So the wizard can wear that. So wizard can wear that. Cut this off. Okay. There you go. Yeah. All right, so that's the druid can't wear it, though. Yeah, the druid no, can't wear it. Okay. Nor can the monk. Monks can't wear it. Well, I mean, they can, but oh, then it, you, it gets rid of the hair. Are you using an axe and a dagger now? <laughs> What's the dex limit on the chain? The range is the hot uh, well, I think the, the, the elf part of it also. But, but uh, yeah, so to the two weapon fighter guy, a plus two and a plus three. Okay. All right. Uh, then I'll take the uh, plus so one hand both axe weapons. back. Yeah. Replace your hand axe and your dagger. Unless you want to keep the dagger for throwing at people. Always keep daggers. <laughs> Two daggers, <laughs> minimum. <laughs> but uh, replace those with a uh, plus three and a plus two short sword. Does the elven The short sword I have now that says plus six. Right. right. Plus three. You'll have one for plus eight, eight and one for plus nine. nine. That's the nine. attack bonus. We'll have, to, we'll, have to re, we'll have to change those numbers again. Well, it's plus, plus six. 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 Plus three. Brock, I'll put the short sword as short sword plus three. Yes. And what else? Uh, then you also have another short sword, which is plus two. Right. You get 13, you get a plus one, and a plus two for dex, so 16 there. Which is slightly better, I believe. Yes. Yeah, because you just be 13. And you're still level nine? 10. You're level 10. So you didn't need to level nine. Nice. How about it? Yes. Yeah, he he leveled when he started. So does the bug here. And and that's the next thing to work on. Okay. You wanted me to give the hobgoblin the two short swords, right? Yeah. Because if they're both light weapons, he can do two weapon fighting, and they have those very large magic bonuses. The sixth level druid now has more HP than the tenth level wizard. And uh, again, uh Jawbreaker's taking the other plus three short swords. Correct. Okay. All right, so that's all short swords you're claimed your now. Hand axe and your regular short sword. No, but it is. So she's using plus three. Yeah, with the short sword and being, uh, the short sword being six. that is plus six. Yeah, that's that's what I was going to look at. This one is plus yeah, six. You don't and this one. The short sword. This short sword. Basic. Okay. All right, plus three next to the short sword. Yes, D six. Okay, so that now. Gives me a lower that, die than my quarter staff. However, mm -hmm. because it's a plus three instead of a plus one, it's the same damage, but it's guaranteed damage. Yes. yes. Yeah. It's actually worth so instead of the minimum damage of being uh, quarter staff two is D eight. Right? What yes. quarter staff is a D eight if you're using it two plus two? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> All that. Of course, you have any chance. The hand axe. Mm -hmm. uh, but yeah, the, the plus two short sword is, is a um, better damage. Okay, let me go ahead and add the uh, plus one hand axe and the plus one. And you said, uh, what's well, the, uh, I don't know why what's the level and the, 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 the druid level and plus two. Uh, uh, plus two. Level so six druid with I mean, no plus of fourteen. Hand axe. Until you hang on to her axe. She's hanging on to the hand axe. Do you need it? Which you I'll well, just put it back in the armor. She just throws it at people sometimes. She's got a dagger too. Okay. I mean, she uses the throw. plus one. Dagger. I have no problem with that. All right. I'll... So the you want this hand axe that says plus one? No, you're keeping that. You can, you can keep it, it if you want to throw it at people. Yeah. But he will put it back in the pool if you don't need it. I don't need it. Do you want it? I, I don't. Do, do you want it? <laughs> I don't think you need it because you, you already have a dagger if you want to throw something, and then really you switch to your longbow. Uh, when you can't reach the guy that you want to shoot, that you want to hit. Mm -hmm. No, you can have that. Okay. All right, so she's got the longbow warning, and you take that out of the pool. That's right, you have the longbow warning now. Yep, she has the uh, longbow warning. No money? No money? No money? No money? Yeah. Gems? No. Yeah, gem C. 
Oh, right. <laughs> <laughs> but what is it? Oh, but uh, is it one of uh, Price Gouge's children can make it Kelly Gouge. I just made that. <laughs> now you have to write it down. <laughs> Three. 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 Oh, okay. So is that, 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 yeah. that a girl? Okay, so it's, a it's a girl. It's a girl. She's single. <laughs> well, yeah. Because <laughs> Lucky is a... You smell rather girl right now. Yeah, it's a D6. <laughs> Can hang out okay. after doing business? Yep, yep. So was it. Yeah. Okay. Alright, so... Okay. Now, uh, the chests are deactivated once they're open. Oh, uh, including allowing you to move them. Uh, do you oh. have any place you want to put them? <laughs> or, or snap? Well, no, because as soon as you close them, they're going to be retracted. Oh. I'll say, yeah. Oh, oh. I, I don't know what you're going to do with them, but. <laughs> Are there any sort of anywhere any sign of where a key may be? No. no. Keys are missing. Actually, for these two. He had previously been recovered by patrols, <laughs> but they were unable to get to the chest. I'm, yeah, I'm sure we can find out. Bombs. It is, it is already a bomb. You want to put a bomb in a bomb? <laughs> so if they get her, no, I was. You integration thing. They you, open it up and it explodes. <laughs> yes, you are ready. But, <laughs> you, okay. <laughs> Clip of boring inside the chest. <laughs> <laughs> that would be nasty. And if they live past the disintegration rate and the glove of boring, you know what? They burn it. They can have the chest. <laughs> Just put a potato in there. Yes. <laughs> okay, uh, I do have a question. Um, stuff that the ogres were carrying is all large size. That's a large size warhammer. Uh -huh. si okay. We're giving that to the truck, though. Well, no, you're going to sell them to Kelly. I was saying, Kelly Gouge is Kelly's here. Control. You want money, right? Who's Kelly Gouge? Oh, Kelly Price Gouge's daughter. Price Gouge's daughter. Who is? Oh, yeah, we just found out about that. Yeah, we just found out about that. So, like, no, 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 no. money. But Lucky called Dibs. <laughs> ah, Dibs! <laughs> Uh, if I can't start my own business, I'll pop my way into it. <laughs> <laughs> I was busy dealing with the trap and you called it a shotgun. <laughs> it's a shotgun. You can't call a shotgun into the vehicle inside. She came over to talk to me. You weren't there. Oh, okay. <laughs> Here, open the chest. That's what don't open the chest. Like so <laughs> what? Three. Okay, so uh, no. that pretty much. Does anybody check out staircase? Well, yeah, we do want to I mean, at least. We were, we were dealing with that stuff. Right? Yeah. Yeah. yeah, but I mean, he's already out selling stuff, uh, and, and you know, you could uh, you could hire some people to do the salvage because you're gonna dig through all that rock to get on higher. <laughs> start start muddling through. <laughs> you live here now. That that's your payment. <laughs> Yeah, we should definitely check out the staircase. Yeah. Wait, yeah. right. uh, the staircase is 10 feet wide. It has a landing, uh, but it's extremely steep uh, to the point where uh, you you have to go slow. Uh, I mean, it's almost like climbing a ladder. Sorry, I can't say it. <laughs> I can't say it. <laughs> no. uh, it's like climbing a ladder uh, because it's so steep. Mm. Uh, but there's a landing at each uh, thing. And it goes up and up and up and up, and it goes about a mile to the surface. So it's a very wow. steep one mile staircase with landings every 10 feet. Oh crap, what is that passage I'm thinking of? It goes past me and it's more hole. That sucks. Yeah, it's sucky. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> it's not convenient at all. <laughs> not, uh... I don't think we need to trap this. <laughs> <laughs> no? Well, I mean. Going down probably isn't that much of a problem. Yeah. Going up would be. 
Have you ever seen those videos of the guys chasing the cheese down the hill? Wait, no, no. I've, <laughs> I've heard of it, and I've heard of it being banned. Real cheese, I, for- <laughs> I forget. Why? I forget the name. <laughs> yeah, it's 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 called the cheese. It's the city. It's from Cheese Run or something like that. And yes, it's it's in Europe. Three um, <laughs> yeah, it Makes sense now. It's in Europe. <laughs> I think it's Scotland or Ireland. <laughs> All right, so the Goblins and Knights, uh, are they attunement? No, they do not require attunement. So we can pass them around as needed, but... Uh, oh, people on watch, pretty much. <clears throat> What's the ring? Uh, it adds 60 feet to 60 so, foot dark vision. Yeah, we'd have 120 feet of dark vision. We'd, we'd be like Scroat. Well, no. Actually, wait a minute. Scroat has... has if Scroat wears it, I say if Scroat has... Does it do anything to his devil? Damn it. <laughs> so he gains so. sixty foot dark vision, but he loses his other. No, so, but yeah. his devil sight just overrides that. Yeah, yeah. So it doesn't matter. Scroat gets no benefit from the government. Right. So it doesn't affect devil sight. It only affects like, dark vision. If you have zero dark vision, it gives you sixty. If you have sixty dark vision, it gives you one hundred twenty. Mm-hmm. So since everybody has sixty foot dark vision. Um, of course, if Sam Carl decides to give up this notion that he wants to stay with the rest of the humans. He has a way to see and hang with us. <laughs> so you could give it to an ally and give him 60 foot dark vision. Yeah. All right. Then. Or pass him around on patrol because they don't require a uh, patrol to uh, watch because yeah. they don't require a tune. Well, with that and case. And then for the most part, just make sure the archers have him so they can start shooting people at 120 feet. All right. So then with that, I want to say the next adventure will be in the cloud of fog and it won't work anyway. <laughs> <laughs> I would say let's have uh, Tokrak start off with one of those goggles out the gate. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Tokrak and Bang Pop. Okay. And then, and then uh, as needed, they will hit and load them off. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Except who needs the third set? Oh, so yeah, that's what I'm trying to figure out. Oh, you're going to give him to Grit. Ah! Grit can shoot. That's right. Okay. Right. So, all right. So, he can shoot at 120 feet. Are we, doing, are we doing a long rest for. Uh, yes, you can chill out here. Um, Lucky wants a couple days to hang out with his new friend. <laughs> and uh, I just generally oversee the setup of uh, Underdark. Uh, yeah, most of the, the one mile uh, staircase. Oh, yeah. Did you want to go outside? Yep. <laughs> uh, you can see uh, Torbell in the distance uh, to the east, uh, but it's it, it's like an eight hour march. Like, oh. I could walk over there, but it would take me eight hours. And if it's cloudy, you can't see it. But today's sun. The opening is the opening comes out in just a little rock outcropping in, uh, in on the top like of the hill. hill. There's no like. This is the grand entrance to no. the. No, it's it's a hole hidden. out of the. Bed. It's hidden. It's yep. actually there's a rock formation, and so like you come out the door, and then you go between the rocks, and there's far back. It's about standard so it's uh, entrance hidden. exits to the Underdark raid hidden. Yeah. Cool. Mm-hmm. Have the lich come do hallucinatory terrain. Hallucinatory terrain. Yeah. All right, you tell him about it, he says okay. <laughs> he, he's busy for the next 400 hours. <laughs> you figure out how many hours he has to do. I did the entire uh, oh, And then split into yours and his. <laughs> yeah. Well, I, start, I started with mine because I just worked from first level up. Yeah. Can you find my piece? Once you got there, you figured out something. Yeah. Well, I mean, you can only do it for eight days or eight hours. Although he relates, he is never tired. Yeah, I was going to say I have the elven trance <clears throat> longsword thing, so I barely have to rest. Somebody said they're going to be late. <laughs> yeah, four hundred and thirty hours. Yeah, I, I, I don't. Once, once I sit down and quit looking at my phone, I just have to look to see. Because Piper said she takes me a math problem. I said, ooh, that was bad timing. <laughs> <laughs> um, Thursdays are not the days to ask for help. Uh, okay. Uh, let's see here. What is in the opposite direction to our uh, Oh, where is the world map? Just wilderness. Oh, oh give me a second. Yeah. I got it over here. Isn't that well, just? Okay. Uh, meadows, south, of Jer- oh yeah, it is. Trees. It is a lot of wilderness plains. Whatever there may be mountainous ranges or hills. Yeah, yeah. there is a Turn lot. Of, like, 
Yeah, it's 12 right days right. or so from the coast of Sydney, whatever you want to go. And then scroll for the uh, one. Uh, Torvella is on a river. I can see it. Uh, <laughs> yes. <laughs> but uh, the uh, entrance to the Underdark area is obviously uh, a ways from the river, more? which is why you can look what down and see Torvella, even though it's so far away. I'm done, okay, so I got core. I've got the map constant, the map yeah. the underdark. I even started what writing down all missing? of the spells. <laughs> I know what map I'm missing. I'm missing the map for uh, the Misty Island. Yeah. Oh, the Misty Island map. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Well, uh, I'm sure you'll find that later. Yeah, I have yeah. it. It's yeah. not that exciting. Yeah. Well, I know we really needed a map so that we could point. And now I'm going here. Here, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, because at some point we are going to be going back there. Because you have the map of uh, core. I do have the map of core. Yes. Core is yeah. all burned down. <laughs> <laughs> well, it's just uh, how many dons do you need? How many dons do you want to stay and hang out? And where are you going next? I'm voting for the old. <laughs> the old she unfair. says she just needs one. <laughs> mm -hmm. uh, I'll say. Right. We talked about this in the third part, right? Yeah. Right. That's, yeah, that's pretty cool. That was the next that's, thing. Cool. That's pretty yeah. The other part of the Kopefe is so that we don't have to go after the drow. Okay, one more rest. Anybody that you need to. Um, yeah, because that gets down. rid of a level of exhaustion, right? Yes. Okay. It does get a, rid of a level of exhaustion. Actually, uh, we're, we're taking two days. And one day. One day. I'm changing characters. Are you asking? Two days? Are you asking to take two days? Yeah, I'm asking to take two days. <laughs> this way I get all my hit dice back. Oh, yeah, yeah. Two oh, days for okay. <laughs> So, an extra day for uh, Nail Split because he's. Uh, yeah, I spent yeah. all of my hit dice on that, on that uh, short rest. <laughs> so, uh. Can you help with that? Yeah, good work done. Oh, yeah. And the so, chances uh, you decided to. We're keeping. We're, 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 we're going to keep them open until we decide what we're going to put in them. <laughs> okay. Jamming them open, putting like a rock, a rock in in it, stick to keep or it from sticking. Or from no, a lot of rocks. Well, like something that you physically can't close, not like knock over in the box yeah. and close. Yeah. Big rocks. So you have to very purposely <laughs> remove the thing and then close the box. <laughs> Look over there. Okay. It, is this edge of the map on the screen? Yes. Okay. Right. Oh, wait, it needs to come down a little bit though, right? Oh, there we go. I was going to say it was perfect, but okay. I was going to say, I think mean, you had it flush. <laughs> I want this to be on the edge. Okay. Yeah, that's one thing. Okay. If I got all that, I'll probably be off. Oh, he needs to go that. Yeah, sorry, I did not mean to push it that far. <laughs> Actually, I didn't push it that far. You had that far. Yeah. yeah, that was you. Allow me. Maybe right. Okay. All right. That's a little under dark map, so we can go there next. <coughs> Interesting. Uh, all right. Got it. So uh, you hunt down Toby to get some info? More info? Just uh, yes. Well, I've got uh, the story written, actually. At least, part, uh, at least some of the details, finer points of it. Uh, basically, because uh, you weren't here, I mean, you, you, you listened to it, so yeah. Uh, but uh, Toby cautions you that you should only take five people, what a coincidence, <laughs> <laughs> into a given area um, uh, until you know that the floor is safe. So if you see that there are more, um, more than five of the fire dwarves hanging out in the area, then you know it's safe and you can bring everybody up. But you need to travel in three separate groups so that you don't fall through the floor in the thin spaces. Uh, it was re okay. really troublesome for the dwarf, for the trolls, trolls because, because right, yeah. one troll is like a whole party. Yeah, this is probably the only time I'm glad Awe isn't with us. Right, there will never be another occasion like this. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I don't think Awe would come down here. Period. Fire dwarves, lava. That's why the dwarves don't come here. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> trolls, 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 trolls. Yeah. Yeah, troll, troll. Or, or the, or the, or the. Purple guys? The <laughs> drought. <laughs> More the drought. Dry don't come here either. Like this guy. Oh, that was just like. 
Oh, just because uh, it's not really going to be what we found. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, uh, okay. So uh, you'll have to dig out or have someone dig out an opening uh, uh, to get uh, through. How, from, thick, how thick is the rocks? Uh, the rocks are just the, the really high piled up rocks there. So they've got like 10 feet worth of, of rocks that they've just piled up to prevent the fire doors from sneaking out. Okay. So it's pretty easy to move them. Uh, uh, but if you're a troll. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. What's the troll? But it takes, a while. it takes some time. Two fabricate spells. We now have a nice doorway with, with an airlock. Make a tunnel. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but right, you need to take it easy because, you know, you got a lot of copy in here. Yeah. But you can still do that because it took two days for nails to get his crap. Yeah. <laughs> so you've turned this into an actual entrance. With airlock doors and all. Um, okay. Uh, but uh, Toby tells you that this first area is safe. Uh, well, last thing it, it was safe. Okay. Do we have any way of sounding? Like detecting how far down the stone goes? No. What level spell is past wall? <laughs> I don't forget. Seven, eight, somewhere. Things you What? Somebody should... It's a fifth level spell. You should send him to Flynn hey. and tell him you're going to be a while. Uh, yeah, we'll do that during the time that uh, Nails is resting. So uh, he's, he's guarding the ship. Yeah. Yeah. Flo is flying the ship towards Torbell. Mm -hmm. Oh, am I going actually to Torbell or by Torbell? Well, that's not in the same name, so you can have to go by Torbell. Yeah. How the hell do I have a 24 for I max it out and then the plus for the Yeah. Uh, I would uh, actually suggest this. We uh, have the witch teleport uh, some red shirts to uh, the ship. So Flo has somebody there to, to defend it. Yeah. Well, to right. help him defend it. And uh, also, there like 50 dragons. 50 dragons. <laughs> Can they pilot the ship while he's sleeping? Where are my dragons? <laughs> they're in. They're at PG 7. Uh, there's only one. You told the first force to acid them. No, you told them to watch them. You didn't tell them to acid them. You want to pour acid on them to make them grow faster. Mm -hmm. or... No, as in acid the eggs. Right. Right. Oh, okay. So I just have the one dragon. Nobody, yeah, you just had the one dragon, which you tried to add. Yeah. In the same order. Oh. He, he just played in it. <laughs> and um, don't worry, the dragon's being That was the original put on egg. The cultists. You still haven't hatched the eggs, then. Huh? I told them yes. Oh. Yeah, we sent we sent descending to hatch all the eggs. Yeah, this was done a while ago. <laughs> Put a date on that. <laughs> we dated it out. I believe it was Four like I believe, <laughs> I believe it was the day after we figured out that acid. Really? Okay. I think it was somewhere around. It was a short, like very short amount of time. Like it was before this one, and then like. And then you went ahead and answered that. It was definitely before the fifth hit the Shan in uh, court. I yeah. say that much. Right. It was before Gary right. changed, you changed, changed, changed the first thing. Yeah. yeah. Right. Um, a very, very sure about that. So you're just saying the day after. Uh, yeah. and how many was that? There was 54 of them. <laughs> uh, yeah. It was 50 something. Give me a second. I'm going that count. <laughs> All right. 57 dragon eggs. Oh. Uh, so, so there's 56, 56 at PG-7. So you hatch 56 eggs the day after you hatch 20. Yeah. Okay. I take notes. <laughs> <laughs> Worked out my favorite. You have four extra dragons. <laughs> yeah, you said 52, now you have five more. <laughs> okay. Uh, I'll make a note of that then. Uh, how long has it been? How old are they at? Uh, like, it's still just, yeah, it's like four weeks, yeah. yeah. What? <laughs> it's, time passes is really slow when it's four hours of straight combat. <laughs> <laughs> when, when, like when, when, when 30 minutes 
takes two hours real time, <laughs> and then that only happens four hours a week. <laughs> the, we don't have that much of a downtime system. Yeah, like how long did the whole combat with the with the with the trolls with the no, ogres with with all the humans and the ogres and the minotaurs and the earthquakes the earthquake combat oh the earthquake right combat. that was like we spent five hours doing that earthquake combat yeah and, and that like was probably like, like, yeah maybe like, two minutes at the yeah. most we did not do twenty rounds in that combat uh, it, we were we were close for twenty by the time you chase the guys down the hallway we a lot around and then fall uh, all the way yeah. through and came back still... next week and cleared out the okay. dropped the cloud kill and cleared out the last human. Yeah. It was it was a good while, maybe twenty rounds, maybe five hours, twenty rounds, right? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Too many. Yeah, you know, five. Yeah. So hence the dragons aren't aging very fast. That was just the experience number four. That was five. Oh. All right. Okay. Uh, so yeah, we uh, let Flo know what's going on. Tell him to steer clear toward well, but head towards that general direction. Uh, Happy Lich teleport uh, some red shirts to him so he has some help guarding the ship. Stay high. And he uh, he gives you the stink eye. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, uh, you can probably handle that yourself, but uh, I'll do it for a fee. Of course, of course you will. Too <laughs> practical to do it. So, uh, Right, I was going to say, like, there's, you have a teleportation circle, yeah. and we have one on the ship. Yeah. Ah, that's right. I forgot about that. Yeah. Okay, well, never mind. We'll so, follow the so, to a crack into it, he just needs $50 worth of chop. Hey, hey don't, don't you be doing that. <laughs> what should we do? I'm about to sell off. Your fitness deal is looking mighty fine. Yeah. <laughs> <clears throat> he, he, has, he has a very oh, large yeah. armory, and he's about to sell. Yeah. <laughs> Seventy-seven credits for money. Or you <laughs> here? Uh, <laughs> pay the lich. I'm gonna say, pay the lich instead. I'm gonna say there's twenty ogres worth of gear. A shit ton of minotaurs worth of gear. I got a plenty of shit. I'm gonna be selling. <laughs> the armory. I'm gonna be doing this in between I this session and next session. I want a receipt. <laughs> uh, so Flo appreciate that though, because he's thinking about throwing these bastards overboard because he's tired of feeding them. Yeah. <laughs> We should put a cultist in a bomb. Here, in a chest. A cultist in a chest. Put food in the chest. Yeah, yeah. That's going to sit out there. And then when the. That's it. Three days. Those warrior kills the cultist. This will also set up the cultist. Okay. That reminds me. Next question. Do you want to take cultists with you down into the underdark? Since you're teleport certain. Oh yeah. One, one one problem with that. That means when we go into a room that may not be stable, that's six people. Oh, no. oh, okay. Uh the wizard's not actually going on the 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 journey, right? So probably not, considering the amount of time. Also so he's out of for a while. And the, flo- 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 on the, the lich, ship. Um Remember that I'm going to be teaching the Lich any spells I know from Xanathar's right. and else. Right. So he's going to be learning some spells. Right. You guys work that out. <laughs> I'll come up with a list. Okay. Um, so uh, you go into, you got a nice entrance now. Yeah, we might, to, we might uh, not want one of the cultists popping through the floor and blasting us all. Okay. Yeah. So we're not taking the cultists. <laughs> Flo and his Richards will keep feeding the cultists. Right. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Or, well, Scrooge can fly, so that's one person who's safe for going through here. Scrooge has a pedophile already. Yeah, they're they're following following the lava? Lava. no big deal. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so let's go to that. This first, this first one is stable. Uh, you, you check it. You check it out. Um, so you go in and uh, you look around. Uh, these blue circles here are actually holes uh, where you can actually see down into the lava lakes. And there's bubbles coming out of the lava. And sometimes the bubbles uh, burst with enough violence that they melt off a bit of the floor, floor oh. from underneath. And sometimes, uh, those are the big ones, the smaller ones blurt uh, lava up onto it and then it solidifies. So the the Thickness of the floor is constantly changing. Uh, 
uh, with these blurp, blurp, blurps. And you have several um, spots where you can uh, check this out because it's just fascinating to everybody who wants to watch it for a while. <laughs> um, actually, the wizard could do, do some scouting with an arcane eye. Yes, That's so you an can idea. send an RKI underneath the... Underneath the thing. And right. Then... Unfortunately, he didn't get to come on this journey. Oh. <laughs> mm -hmm. um, uh, from the first area here, when you uh, look down the hallway for area three, uh, that floor has collapsed. That's where all of Toby's buddies died, when that area collapsed. Um, but looking down each of these uh, exits, you see that there are... Uh, additional areas that look like this with different configurations uh, of direction, but the same uh, layout. All right, before we go too far in this. These are solid walls? Yes. Okay. Well, and they're all natural. So this is not work stone, this is natural stone. <laughs> in fact, it's lava rock. <laughs> oh, uh, and only the only illumination is coming from these lava pits, I'm assuming? Uh huh. Okay. So that's dark down here. All right, cool. Uh, but before we go too far into this, uh, one of the things that Nail Splits definitely wanted to uh, question Toby about is any idea about how far away he saw that drow temple? Because you know, I've been thinking about that for a long time. Unfortunately, one of my compadres was carrying the map and he fell in the lava. Of course he did. And uh, I don't, my memory of the entire situation is pretty off because uh, I was very upset at the time having just lost my mate right. and spending days just running for my life uh, because of the fire Okay then. Alright, bring him down. Sorry. Right. <laughs> That's another thing that I have to consider if I summon things. Yeah, if you summon a bear or something. Yeah, maybe heavy. shape shift into something heavy. Yeah, we should probably be okay with shape shift. What you can bear is probably just because you're gonna get right. Uh, I think there's a const <laughs> I, think, I think the giant constrictor snake is huge. It is. Yeah, but I don't think it's gonna weigh as. It's no, it's not this huge. It's no. so large. It's no, large. No, no, no. no. Or I can turn into that. that. I can maybe, turn into this. Maybe. Okay. I might not be able to. Oh, shite. I can summon those. This occurred to me. I may not be able to do this. Oh, nope. I think your, your own big badass is going to get down here. <laughs> here you go. <laughs> um, oh, come on, man. I'm less than 2k away from 13 but the, uh, the, the fire <laughs> dwarf. That's why I'm all goblins. <laughs> the fire dwarves, though, have a sense of when it's safe. So if you ever see more than five fire dwarves, um, you know that that room is safe, not only to add reinforcements, uh, but also to change into a giant constrictor snake or something. So if you have a big fight where you want to be a giant constrictor snake, it will be a safe place to do it. All right, good. Put Nails put back in there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, uh, Nails put that guy. Yeah. Okay. Don't worry, Lucky's going to be coming there on this. I just want to get Nails put to at least 13th level, and then I'll switch him out and bring uh, Lucky back in, because then I need to get... Lucky's Paladin levels up. Ooh, yeah. yeah. Oh. So you're going to do front group, second group, third group, or are you going to bring two groups and leave four people back at the... I think we'll be okay just doing two groups of five and keep Just other... having a secondary group of five to reinforce and a yep. big battle. Right. Right, so you're bringing Lucky and... Nails uh, Yeah, Lucky Nails will be on this go. So Lockjaw is going to stand behind. Uh, yes. With the wizard. Mm-hmm. Also, he's Lockjaw's going to be talking a lot with Toby just to get more ideas. So every once in a while, uh, should they have to send messages, to so he can uh, get some more information. So Lockjaw is going to attach himself to Toby and just hang out chatting. Uh, so that if you need any information, you can check with Lockjaw. Exactly. Yeah. And also, if any of your spells are not in the player's handbook, but is a wizard spell, you might want to throw that. I'll, I'll look through. I'll add cleric spells into mine. So I'm going to take Chino, Crack, and Jawbreaker. Just, you know, split them up depending on 
Next party screen or drawer. So Head Snap's gonna hang out with Lockjaw. Right. They brought a bucket from the ship and they've been playing spit in the bucket. Hmm. Well, after the ass company he took from the angel, that's about all he's going to do right now. And uh, who are you gonna leave behind? Christine? Uh, um. Pick two. And the third is a. Ah, oh, fuck, this one is almost ten. Bring them back. I think we got a buck. What should we call Wait. the first chamber? Should we call it one, or should we switch to letters and call it game? <laughs> <laughs> um, no letters because letters. Yeah, but there's numbers on the entrance, so it's like already numbers have letters. This uh, thing has That's good if you're calling a lot, but. Oh, that's great. That's great. You're calling a lot. So. Primus, secundus, then. <laughs> <laughs> really fucked up with my Roman, Roman numerals. Yeah, there we go. Yeah. She's the two weapons. That's great. Okay, so so far you know uh, this uh, one entrance from the first Primus area. <laughs> <laughs> okay. it's got a yeah, let me know when we get to 10. Um, <laughs> is that the one you're saying um, is the better one? The, uh, yeah, I don't know. We're not. No, we're not. <laughs> <laughs> well, these guys are the ones who are in trouble. We'll call it double A, though. How about that? That way it'll be separate from the uh, area. Okay. okay. Um, so, double A is the first place. Uh, you know that going down corridor three leads to a pit of lava. So, you don't go that way. <laughs> Unless, unless we want to fly across the damage section. To call this the Fonzie room. The Fonzie room. Hey. Really? We got to jump the sharks with this? Really? Lava <laughs> Don't give him any idea. Uh, Lava shark. Oh, I, I have advantage on his throws against right, plants somebody. that are magically oh, created. Huh? Oh, such a leave useful thing. Leave the hobgoblin. Yes, in tangle. So then we just need a uh, first group. So who's gonna go in the front? First group. Uh, this first group. Uh, no. Uh, uh, Lucky, Lucky's right. gonna be Lucky's gonna be the second group. Uh, we just decided who's same I'm as. I'm also. And now we're in two groups. Group. First group, second group. The first group and second group can switch off and on as often as you'd like. Okay. I'll say I, I'm sending nails blade with the first group. That's okay. Nails blade's let's go in first group. Yeah, this is Let's just put nail, nail spot on the middle of the map here. Okay. And who else is first group? Pick, 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 pick. Steve and KT. Makes no difference to me. Yeah. Or head snap. What's, Steve and KT. What's the con so are we considering Magic. Are we considering both of them yeah, yep. the same or one unit? We're considering them one medium creature. <laughs> okay. Um have we got Ranged weapons in the first group yet? Nope. Nope. <laughs> Maybe we ought to throw Toe Crack in there. Toe Crack goes in the first group. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, I don't want it. Next group? Okay. I'm just going to call damage on the fire door from this lad. <laughs> <laughs> and then we need. Root Rot or Heartbreak? Root Rot or Heartbreak? Root Rot at the front, Heartbreak at second. So this will be our second group trailing behind the first group. I'll just set them over here. The, uh, um, the wizard can occasionally help with constructing shit. If you, already sh busy. if you shout back to them, mm -hmm. uh, they will arrive at the end of round two. All right. So if you say it's safe, they'll end at the end of round two. At the, yeah, they'll arrive at the end of round two. So you can't, uh, well, uh, you can't, without inconvenience, go down corridor three. So which corridor do you want to go down instead? I fly across corridor three. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> traps down there. <laughs> well, uh, no, I mean, you could just fly down the thing, but then, you know, you're going to run into something eventually, and then what? So, I'll be fine. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'll just kill one myself. <laughs> I'll just kill myself. Yeah. 
Uh, else watch. Um, which way, uh, which corridor do you want to go uh, down and instead? Now, uh, the temple that you're looking for is across two. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the temple okay. that you're looking for is across the lake of lava. So, uh, I mean, I probably would have chosen six. You didn't tell me But that. to tell you the truth, it's random, so it doesn't matter. <laughs> so what do you mean across? Do we know which direction the lake of lava is? It starts here. Which, 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 which one do you want? This is the edge of the lake of lava. You can tell by uh, looking down the hole. And it goes that way. And that way. And that way. <laughs> now I need to die because this is where you actually end up with rent. <laughs> so with, with this hole, let me see if Arcane Eye just has an innate limit or... Give me three days. Also, the wizard can't play. Yeah, I was just saying, as <laughs> it's right at the start, you can just look down the uh, down the hole. Oh, um. Do we want to give the gem of seeing to the druid? And it just grants true sight for a little bit? Uh, essentially, yeah. Don't have any bonus vision. Mainly because, huh? Yeah, yeah. Everybody. Yeah, everybody. Set up last. Oh, yeah, so. Do you tie off them? Have we given them a map? Uh, just for when you're entering. Anyways, the reason why I'm thinking uh, Jim obscene might be in handy is. We're going to a drow temple. Who knows what illusionary is uh, left yeah. over? Yes. Good idea. Let's do that. So you, you, you guys come in. Alright. Huh? You've got a two minute slot for days. Uh, Rubrock doesn't have any two minute slots left right. up, so yeah. that makes. Yeah. Is it a two minute Hold this. Mm -hmm. Yes. It does require okay. two minutes. Uh, That's uh, why. Like where I am. <laughs> uh. Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, I assume I you're doing the scouting. Yes. For dark vision, thin spots, side. and whatnot. Mm -hmm. Yeah, double thing, not dark vision. Anybody think to bring a 10 foot pole? I, no, I was thinking <laughs> that. <laughs> I, I am saying a 11 foot pole. <laughs> <laughs> bragging, bragging. Because DMs are ready for the 10 foot pole. You gotta have that extra foot. Sometimes you gotta turn it, turn it up to. When the blade comes down ten feet from the place you poked. Aha! That's why I have an eleven foot bow. Uh, so you guys are coming down to this next area, and uh, you hear some dudes <laughs> around the corner there. So uh, we should roll for initiative. Okay. How long are the corridors? Uh, they're relatively short. I guess it's going to take two rounds for group two to arrive at this space okay. if you um, yell for them. So that's like 120 feet. Ish. Because uh, I was wondering uh, if I like summon a bunch of note ropes at the beginning of how no, long I can keep them. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. So this is going to be section BB or what we're about to go into. Uh huh. All right, so section <laughs> AA, that's going to get annoying. <laughs> Anyways, so section double A, that was just basically the entryway, see where everything is. Okay, and then there was uh, the one lava, one known lava. Yeah, yeah. okay. But now you've uh, moved up here and you're in area BB. So correct, goes on nine. That's a good number. That's kind of what he wants. He always wants to... He wants to know goes first and whatever. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Uh, nail split's going on 19. Druid is on 8. He plays one. 12. And Steve's going on 
Oh, uh, one other quick question, Ryan, as we're doing this. Uh -huh. uh, when we were in uh, section double A, uh, that room here, where you said number three, was that to the south, to the east? It was to the south. It was to the south? No, okay. So that's the reason she came from the south. They had, yes, in their, in their clean, they had come from the south. And they almost made it home before they fell in. Um, so, uh, the, the, this room is lit up, so, but you're around the corner still, but you can tell that there is a light source over here. Oh, not just the ambient light from the... Right. Okay. So who's, oh, I should roll. <laughs> you probably should <laughs> Yeah. Me, go, I was just like, okay, you guys run enemies the first one, just kill them all so you know you're fighting. Not there too. So who's first? Skirt. I'm running around the corner. Okay, so Skirt runs around the corner. Uh, and you see that these are indeed fire drawers. They're, they're slightly skinnier than a regular drawer. Uh, their faces look like they're made of fire. Like a Azir? It's an Azir. <laughs> uh, the light source that you see uh, from around the corner is actually the Azir themselves. They give off 10 feet of bright light and 10 feet of dim light. So uh, they are what is lighting up the room. Which makes them really easy to spot. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> mm -hmm. So you move uh, two, so then you're going to hook her up dark. Finger mm -hmm. of a dog. <laughs> Makes it really hard for the monk to shadow step behind me, though. Yeah. You just need to put the there some behind, you're fine. <laughs> <laughs> if they're against the wall, it doesn't matter. But that also means that everything surrounding them casts shadows. Huh? Including your allies. And each other. Yep. Well, no, because no, each one is a kind of or otherwise so. can illuminate the area. Okay, so, so you're making it dark. Well, and also they get murdered. Yeah, that's it. <laughs> so first it's dark, and then they get murdered. Yes. Uh, uh, fabric of space. Difficult for any, any creature that starts its turn takes 2d6 cold. Any creature that ends its turn in the area, er, that ends its turn in the area, deck save or take 2d6 acid. I'm sorry, I was reading, you'll have to say it again. Okay. So your turn 2d6 cold. Okay. And you turn 2d6 acid on Dex. And you area this. Yes, 20 foot radius. So where yeah. is the 20 foot radius? Down. Okay. <laughs> okay, and then you're doing anything else? You're standing right there? Doing uh, action. No, just kind of stand up here. I can actually see into the darkness. Right. So we're going to total of six. Right, I'm not going in there. Right, that's, that's <laughs> it. That would be done. Okay, who's after you? No, but. Okay. Uh, right, and he made it dark and cold and acidic over there. And tentacly. Yeah, that, that's, yeah. With tentacles. So, yeah. Okay. Like All right, so, uh, oh, it's like, like one, two. <laughs> looks like I could go four paces. I'll give me to the corner. Is that right? Four. Be at the corner. Yeah. <laughs> and it's dark. Really? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I will wait until I see one of them come out and get within two more squares of me, then I'll run up and attack. <laughs> We're gonna uh, prepare a charge. Yeah. Prepare a charge. Yeah. All right. Actually, you know what? No, no, screw that. I will ready a uh, Tola day. Gonna ready a Tola day. Yes. Okay. Because uh, they're gonna be damaged. And uh, it's simple training too, as well. Right? Yep. Okay. And they're sure as stuffy dwarf. <laughs> They're skinny though. 
Can't run very fast. <laughs> uh, who's after? Uh, their turn. It is their turn. They take eight cold. And uh, do they get to save at all? Not on that one. Okay. <laughs> so they just take eight damage each. Yep. All right. Are they damaged yeah. or resistant? No, they are not. So right. they're fine. And you were going to do what? Toll the day. Cancel. So, toll the day. So when this guy steps in into uh, where you can see him, you're going to toll the dip. Yes. Uh, DC is 16. Do through 12. They're damaged. Yep. We have the 12 to do it right now. Yeah. Is there any other? I'm sorry. What was the DC? 16. And what kind of a save? Uh, necrotic. Uh, yeah. What kind of save did that make? Uh, oh, wisdom. wisdom. Sorry. We think it's save. I believe it's wisdom. I'll okay. double check that. Uh, he does save. He does save. Okay. okay. Oh shit. You're all the way. Now he hits you with his uh, spear. He's got a spear and a shield. And he gets you. Who did he hit? Me. Oh, he Ooh, tries to. 17. Yeah, you still fire off. Yeah. <laughs> Although you're a plus five, that's cool. Yeah, plus five. Had to make it a little tougher this time around. Uh, so uh, the other ones had to move too far so they didn't get to attack. Um, this one, though, after he saved, he gets to step forward and attack. Nail split. 23. And you hit me. All right. And he does D8 and D6. Uh, his weapon is super hot, causing searing pain when he stabs you. Ow! Cauterizes the wound. Make sure I get that right. Yep. Uh, 15 damage. Ow. Ow! Who's after? The Yazir. Which we are calling them now. Uh, be play. B flame, what are you gonna do? Um I don't know. Got a lance. Let's see Gonna run up and poke did you roll for Steve? I did, he's on five. So oh. I can They've all come out of the darkness now, so you can shoot them. Oh. Oh, so you do kinda have some on one of them being on that. Or or shoot if you're going before Steve, then you should just like I'm gonna ready action to stab with the lance. And then when Steve moves you get to attack. Okay, I'll do that. Alright. Okay, Choker. I'm going to, uh, run up where I've got sight on a few of these guys and you drop open the fire. Okay. Now, left. Yeah. I have a question. Can I see them? Yeah. Yes. They're lit up like torches. Because I can put a soul touch on one. That's a cantrip, right? So, can I just like. She'll touch this guy, I think? She'll touch that guy. Okay. Yeah. yeah, it's only 35 feet, so she should be plenty of range. Yeah, okay. It's touch in it. It has touch in it. I'm concerned that it. No, it's like a spectral hand. That's it's a like, hand. It's a skeletal yeah, hand. Like, it's like, make a hand that touches it. Yeah, like that. So, the rest of the uh, yeah, 120 foot range. No, it's not me, too. You guys are all off today. You changed it to the, my, my setup here. Now. Yeah. Um, yeah. 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 Charisma modifier, right? Oh, it's 14. Okay. Nope, that's your same thing. Yeah, that's your charisma. What, you said what are charisma. You doing? You're, oh. you're con. Yeah, flip it over. Yeah. Where are your spells? Oh, the. Range tank on that top. Seven. Okay. 17. 17 is a hit. Okay, roll 2 again. How are these guys armored? 
Mm. They have shields and they're just tough. <clears throat> okay. So, blind class? Yep, let's go with that. Or blacksmiths, um, smocks. They're into that too. <laughs> uh, fireproof, obviously. Uh, I forgot already. Five damage, you said? Okay. So that guy's got 13 damage. Uh, so you don't have any action, but Steve will get to do Steve's thing on Steve's turn. Who's after B play? Tokrak. Tokrak, right. You were going to run up and start shooting? I was going to run up and start shooting. That's probably good enough. You got a few tenors. There we go. Um, so we're going to get in the way. Okay. Going to go for the damage run? Might as well. And you're shooting after seeing damage? I'm shooting for damage, yeah. Okay. Uh, um, 15. 15 is a miss. 17. 17. Yeah, so the ratio is 16. Or 17. Or 17. Oh, yeah. 17. <laughs> I forgot the ties. Ties work. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Okay, so shoot for damage. Yes. Okay. Uh, I rolled a 19. So that's a hit. Pretty sure that's a hit. Uh, 22. Twenty-two and bring him to thirty-five. All right. All right. He's still standing, but he's looking pretty weak. Shoot him again. Is this the second shot or is this the third shot? My third. He missed with the first. Wow. Missed the first. Okay. Seventeen on the die. That's plus something or other. I hit plus seven. Yeah. Wait, you're plus seven for damage. I'm. I'm plus. Eight. Seven to hit. No, I, yeah, I'm plus for no, the damage shot. I'm plus seven to hit for the damage shot. Right. Plus yes. twelve normally. Plus five to damage. And and, no. and, plus, <laughs> and plus plus the ten. Regular shots plus twelve. Regular shots plus damage 12. shots plus seven. Right. That's what I was asking. Okay. That's, what, that's what you got. Yeah. Um, max damage on that one. That says. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, and but you only get three shots. Are you done moving? You've only moved three. Um, yeah, I'll, right, right back. I'll stand back. I, I still got range on Steve. Figure out what he's doing. Let the other guys Steve go. I'd be unimpeded. Okay, well, get, get that ready. Get that five, ready. Five, five, Steve's root rock turn. It's a new one. Then you need. All right. I'm going to go in what front. This one's from? Five, in five, case this one got the storm. Oh. In front of uh, Steve, Ray of Frost, the far guy, cool. and then right behind Nils. You want to be right there? No. No. Behind him. That's okay. Okay, cool. Yeah. One, two, three. Yes. Nils was here and Togrank's here, and you're behind both of them. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> but you just uh, shot that guy. Yep, right. Here. And uh, he has cover? No, I moved over to the side. You were he over does. here. So you're shooting this guy, this guy, this guy. Who are you? This guy would have cover because he's standing in the way, but you, you shoot this guy or this guy. Doesn't matter. You're shooting this guy. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Well, one of those guys is one of those guys is not covered. Right. That's the important thing. And Ray Frost is DH, right? Yes. And you get two of them on level five. Okay. Where'd you get the hit? And roll a 13 on the roll die. Roll a 13 on plus 8. Yeah. So, he hit. 5. Alright, so now he had 13 damage. <laughs> Alright, then Steve Nates. He's yeah. got 40 movement, so can you get right into the middle? Don't forget your craft ability. Yes, we're doing counting 20 straight. Yeah. <laughs> there? Can you hit that guy there? Yeah, you just want to go there and whack on that guy? He does this whole bite claw claw thing. Okay. Counts. Move 20 straight. Claw. Hit. Okay. Now do a claw. Claw. Yeah, I'll do a claw. Claw. Do the claw first. And if it works on that one, yeah. 16 on the bed? Uh, yes, he's got at least plus one, so yeah. And is this, is that the D8? Yeah. Claw. No, it's D8 plus two. Three. Okay. Now, 
uh, Dwarf Man has to do DC 12 strength save. DC 12 strength save. Um, oh, he's both French. Bro. Or else he gets knocked down. The dice got knocked down. Right. We're going to die down. We're going to die down. You got 13. <laughs> then just finish up with Claws and Bite. Oh, wait. But are you getting the count? So what? Two damage is three. Cool. Yeah. And then did the pounce didn't work, the so you should have knocked him down. So now just hit him with another claw and a bite. The other claw and bite. Claw and bite. Claw and bite. Claw and bite. Let's use plus four. Good. Sixteen. Miss. All right. So Let's see if you like seventeen long days. That's it. Very good, right? Right. The bite is eight plus eight. Seven. And he's up to twenty-three damage now. All right, who's after speed? Another round. Can you do a bonus action one more? Now, now, since there were only five dwarves here, uh, you you don't know that this is safe, so it'd be best if you didn't bring your reinforcements up. You can bring them to D, but not further than that. No, because no, because you might just collapse the whole thing if you bring. Oh, them okay. Up. Also, there's only five guys. Now there's nine. Mm -hmm. Do we count corpses? Yes. So ten. We'll, <laughs> we'll shove the corpses so down the hole. You're not sure this would be a safe place because there are only five corpses. So that's all, all we're saying. Yeah. Gotcha. Mm -hmm. Uh, did end of the round, anything special upon that one? No. Okay. Scott's gonna uh, smack that guy. The real damage guy. The damage guy? Yeah. 26. Pop that place. Ooh, uh, did they get their. Dwarven poison? They are actually completely in the end point. Oh. Still 16 points there. Oh, shit. <laughs> um, you shot this guy, and you... Uh, Steve is the only one. Who's done a man attack? Who's done a man attack? Yeah, I was I was gonna ask that. Yeah, Steve actually takes five damage when he but when he claws the uh, the deer because the fire leaps from his skin onto your your skin and burns you. Does that also happen when they make mana attacks? Yeah. Oh, that's added into the weapon. Then. Right. Yeah. But if you hit them, you take damage. Now we don't catch on fire. So, you know, you just take Ow! <laughs> so you just hit the guy. For over four plus plus sixteen points of damage, do the fire on me too. Right, and then you get fired. Yeah, but you did sixteen points of damage during thirty nine, so you killed the guy. Okay, second attack. So you're gonna attack this guy over here next to me. Yeah. Sixteen plus sixteen. You take one point of fire damage. How many attacks? Like one. Uh, for another 16 points there. So it's 24 for him total. And you got Hadard. And then? Uh, okay. So we just have to you. No, but. Alright. There's a guy right in front of you. Uh-huh. Uh, but every time somebody hits one of them, the fire leaps onto their body and causes damage. To counter that? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, or we can add uh, set, well, had it set of the nine, so. Yeah. yeah. Uh, put it in between the two. Uh -huh. So directly in front of, yeah. Right there. Uh, so, bonus action, uh, bringing that in, and then it will do its attack on, which one is one? The damaged one is behind you? Mm -hmm. Okay, so yeah, we'll go ahead and have spiritual weapon attack that one. I like that spiritual weapon. That thing. Mm -hmm. Uh, be 23 to hit. Okay. I don't remember how many hit points he's different. And four, ten points of damage. So that's thirty-four. Is that twenty-five? No, it's thirty-nine. Okay. Ah! I'll get thirty-nine hit points each. Yeah. Okay. And then what are you gonna do? Uh Jackson Cold Armor. I don't have that. <laughs> no, yeah, that's, that's oh, okay. Before we go to the next thing. 
Oh, okay. You're going to hurt me. I'll hurt you guys. <laughs> <laughs> I guess I'm just going to go ahead and swing at him with my morning star. Just going to lay him up. Yeah. So, morning star attack. Well, if you miss, you don't get damaged. That's, yeah, I mean, <laughs> it's one of those debating is it worth doing the channel divinity because these guys can hurt a lot if you just let them stay or hit them, let us hurt us still, but get rid of them quicker. Is that turn back? Then, based off that, yeah, I'll go ahead and burn one of my channel divinities because I didn't do any of those last time. So that makes it a 24 to hit. I couldn't remember who that was. Scrub. With his poison stick. Yeah. <laughs> All right. Got my poison. Do the color. <laughs> so 15 points of damage on that guy. And right. how much does he do to me? He does 8 to you. Ow. Uh, you only have one attack. Uh, yeah, because I used my bonus action for the uh, spiritual weapon. Okay. Oh, yeah, that's right. You, uh, your second attack is a bonus action. Okay, uh, who's after Nails? Mosses. Mosses. I can't speak to you. Okay, so we just have two of them trying to whack on uh, Scroot, and they get 22s. They both got 22. Yeah, I'm having a good nice day. <laughs> no. Oh no. Uh, I shield. Okay. Uh, so that doesn't hurt. And then this one is going to go ahead and hit Nail Split. This is going to the whole time. I think that's a 24. <laughs> Pretty much. Okay. Ow. Uh, so you take. Okay. You get 11 damage. So these are your negative seal dwarfs. Negative seal dwarfs. Yeah. No, this is, this is Delta Force because these can't go underwater. the water. <laughs> they can't go underwater. It must be Delta Force. Uh, all right, that's the dwarf. Cool. B play. B play, you're standing there next to things. Uh, if you poke a guy within five feet of you, the fire jumps out and hits you. So. Wait, does your lance have a 10 foot reach? It is. What if you stab a guy on the other side? Oh, of you? Lots, yeah, over there. So you're just going to lance that guy over there so you don't get the heat damage. That's what I would do. I would do. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I, in reality, I would say that guy took that. That's the way to fight. <laughs> okay, that's all too close, but you had to get around the corner. So. Um, Alright, so you're going to hit that guy. What is channel divinity? Oh, because you're a Yes. Oh, ah, that's book. right. It is yes. <laughs> it depends on the type of paladin you are when it vengeance does. paladin. And I don't know oh, off the top of my head because I haven't looked at that one yet. Doesn't it say something right under that? Yeah, it's the vow of enmity thing. Oh, yeah. It's when you vow of enmity. <laughs> You declare somebody your enemy, and then you can hit the martyr. And they have issues hitting anyone else. Oh, okay. Hmm. Did, did I this way? Is this way? Oh, okay. As long as that's in fair mind, and you can take the chance to take the I would stab that one, then you read this. <laughs> yeah, especially, uh, right, you're level five or so, so it's stabbing Six twice four. with the lance, so okay. just start stabbing. I'll just start stabbing. It's 18 on dice. That's good. Plus it in. D12 plus four. D20. Wait, is it this one? Oh, well, Yeah, this one is the same thing. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> All right, that takes him up to 20 damage. And then we do it again. Mm -hmm. Right. And we get a net. A crit. Crit. Did we do two of those? Two of those, yeah. yeah. I can use that's and that. That's mm -hmm. cool. Plus the number. Mm -hmm. That's one. Right. So we get 10 and 16 plus the 4, right? Uh huh. That's 34. No. No, do 20 then. Yep, 40 damage. 
So that kills him. Uh, don't forget you can Divine Smite, where you throw in some spells to do extra damage. Divine Smite. Yeah, but you didn't need that. But <laughs> also, did, also, I should have did the Hunter's roll, roll. Also, roll the second roll. Roll another d20. Okay, I roll another d20. Yes! Oh, oh fuck his soul! Magic last time, then, isn't it? Nice. Uh, okay. Uh, roll one more d20 to determine what the uh, bonus is for your weapon. 14. So you now have plus two land. Jay's put plus two in here. Yep. Nice. Yep, we're just going to add two to the to hit number and add two to the damage. Two to the attack bonus? Damage? And, yeah, both. Six. Oh, okay, so plus nine, nine and then six? Yep. Alright, cool. Alright. Nice. That was a good fight. <laughs> yeah, that was good. <laughs> Okay, and who's after uh, I just stabbed a dude to death and sucked a soul into my land? <laughs> 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 yeah. okay. So, Greg. Step over the side? Yeah, step over the side and uh, start shooting these people in the face. Yeah, okay. 88, yeah. Should be one each, so assuming you miss one, so you'll finish them all. Alright. <laughs> Ooh, I think I missed one. And that was the miss. <laughs> so, one more each, and you're in. That wasn't a mess. That's an 18 on the die. Okay. What's the damage? Uh, max damage. 23. Alright. And then the other one? That's a 17. Exactly right. Or 18. I know, yeah, it doesn't matter. Yep. Read up on on the the divine smite thing too. Why are they divine smite? Okay. Uh, okay. It's an awesome thing. So you smash these awesome guys. Thing. Uh, their spears are perfectly normal. They're just extremely hot while they're holding them. Uh, once you kill them, uh, they start to cool off to the ambient temperature. And shields. And cool blacksmithing smocks that are hard to read. I was say, you know what? Fireproof smocks are good. <laughs> you have now given me balloon material. Yeah, balloon material. All right. Some people have buckets, some people have smocks. <laughs> how, how many smocks does it take to make a balloon? <laughs> <laughs> but once he sees the smocks and what they're made out of, then he can just produce more. Oh, yeah. So. Uh, unfortunately. I think it had to produce mm -hmm. actual matter stuff. Yeah, but it's only temporary. Oh, that's right. Just All long right. enough to drop it from a thousand feet. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Um, Hold on. on. Uh, when it comes to these dwarves, though, so they don't dissipate, they don't uh, no, they're corporate they're ash, they're corporate their actual bodies there. Mm -hmm. So they're all born here. Uh, so if you. Uh, I'm cool. I'll bet you can take your skull. Well, see, yeah. <laughs> I want to know one of these skulls are black. Yeah, I'm going to black skulls. No, unfortunately, they're not black. What? Shenanigans. Why are their beards made out of fire? They don't have beards. Because they're on fire. They're on fire. Oh, okay. <laughs> fire beards. Yeah. But I can't, I can't take those. No, because they go out when they die. Mm -hmm. All right. Do you still have a spiritual weapon? I run down the hallway. <laughs> okay. Uh, but yeah, this area will be empty. The B area will be empty? Oh. So it's just these five. Okay. So yeah. this area is, sense. is probably dangerous. What is the violence? You can know the location of any source of pain under these 60 feet. Keep my levitating spell to... at the ready. <laughs> if the floor falls in, <laughs> I'm gonna wave at y'all. Oh, 
Well, I've already got feather fall rings, so I'm going slow. Yeah. So you can cast levitate. Right. right. Oh, yeah. Uh, the lava was 300 feet down. Oh, gosh. Okay. It's, it's 300 feet. So it's if you fall dead through and have. Double dead. Yeah, yeah, but if you fall through and have a feather fall ring, you'll have a few minutes to think about it. <laughs> a few seconds to think about it uh, on your way down. Really? Yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> <laughs> Which way are you going to go? Why is that? Does anyone care where we go? Or is this a I just, I'm going for a. Well, we know that based on the story that uh, Toby mentioned, uh, it's south. Right. So I say we go over one, which we just. This is what we did, right? Why is that true north? What do you think about uh, doing the mountain climber strategy of spreading out and tying everybody together so that if somebody falls through the floor, the rest of us are holding on to him on a rope? Which means even if all of us go down, at least one of us can fly. Maybe yeah, we can't carry you all, so we're dragging in. Mm -hmm. What's the strength? Flying in the air, mm -hmm. and I like four hundred fifty pounds. Yeah. Six foot seven. <laughs> okay, he doesn't get tied on. <laughs> I'm gonna say he's more skinny. You know, I just let it go. He's little. He's not that big. He weighs well, he weighs twice as much as me. No, he's, Steve's only he's medium. Limited. Does work on a touch? Steve's only medium, so he's a. Uh, he's a medium. Yeah, he's not. We tie ourselves to these ourselves, and somebody falls. Maybe two fifty. We're gonna clarify exactly what this is. I'm almost ready. You wouldn't want to cut me off. We're gonna clarify exactly what this is. Wait, wait, wait. The treasure says throw me. Throw me at the earth. Give us your stuff, man. We're the party charter. You cannot die until you bequeath yourself to us. You're like. Okay, I'll throw you something. <laughs> <laughs> I have a plus two air. Uh, okay, so you're roaming around here and you don't find anything else in this area and you decide to go to. Okay, so again, we went over one, yeah, right? Yeah, absolutely. So. <laughs> oh. How tall are the scenes? The fact that I roll to see which one we exit does not matter because he's going to roll one to see which one we come down. Oh, shenanigans! How tall is this? <laughs> Okay. Uh, How big is your opening? Oh, uh, you know, it varies quite a bit. Some places it's as high as 30 feet, some places it's only 10 feet. So, and sometimes these little tiny corridors are only like 6 feet. So, uh, it's natural like, cave. Yeah, it's yeah, yeah. more like cavey. So, if you want to fly in the large areas, you should be fine, oh. but in the small areas, not so fun. Not so good. Alright, and so if it's all random, I guess it doesn't matter which way we go then. Yeah. <laughs> I'm drawing it. Alright. No, it's this way. <laughs> okay, that's fine here. And I'll take the, the uh, spiritual yeah. weapon back. I like to tie a rope to Steve and levitate without uh, being dragging along. <laughs> Just yeah. you <laughs> like a kite. <laughs> oh, what is the distance between uh, room BB to room CC? Yeah. 220 feet. Okay. Is that the way it is for all the rooms or is, is that very too? Nope, it's well it, within 10 feet or 20 feet. I mean since all natural is not exact it wasn't laid out that way. Okay. But they're all about that far. I can't shield. But it's not a 20 minute walk from one. Nope. I can't shield Steve. Nope. Okay. Can I shield Steve? Can I shield Steve? Like magic spell shield? Yeah. Because yeah. it's self. If it's self and I'm on top of it. I think it's. I think it doesn't matter if it's self anyway. I believe you can shield Steve. Hmm. Yeah. 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 
Uh, so you guys are walking in, and you hear the doors around the corner very excited ball. Okay, uh, quick question before we uh, jump into this. How badly is everybody yeah. hurt? I'm not very five points of damage. You want to give him something? You might, you might want to do some healing on you. Well, see, I got 34 points, points of damage done to me. Yeah. I've got five. Uh, yeah. <laughs> he I got hit twice by these bastards. They did a lot of damage. Yeah. They did hard twice. <laughs> Sorry, I, I forget how much <laughs> damage. I don't have shield. <laughs> if I'm blessed. Okay, uh, yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and spend at least one third of the spell right now. Everybody, uh, everybody roll for uh, initiative check right after he heals himself. <laughs> Is there something I can do? Only one in 20th matter. Don't okay. forget to roll for Steve. Whenever you do initiative, Steve has to do his own. He's the black guy. Okay. No, they both rolled 18. Okay, and they're both the same as they were before. So we're not going to be able to just listen in? No change. Is there something I can... Can I lay on hands? Yes. Yes. I don't think For you need to worry months. about healing Steve. Don't worry about healing Steve, then. Because when he dies, he goes... And then you summon him. And he's but it takes a level 2 it's spell, and it takes 10 minutes. Right. Okay. Take your level 2 spells. <laughs> Take your level two, your, your lay on hands for emergency defibrillators. Right? Emergency defibrillators. Yeah. Alright, yeah, well, this is bad. You don't want him to be. Oh, shit. <laughs> Alright, I'm fine. Lay on hands. I have the healing potion. We all have healing potions. Um, we all have tattoos. Good shit. What's the run home? Oh, you can't get sick and stuff. Let's see. Yeah. 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 Now I'm gonna start calling her on Wednesday afternoon. <laughs> Did you do your homework? <laughs> okay. Uh, so you hear them fluttering around around this wall, but Flutter. you can't. No, fluttering, uh, making noises, uh, giggling. Shields and spears at the ready. Whoa, 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 whoa. Do you speak Igman? No, I speak Infernal. Then you don't know what they're talking about. <laughs> uh, so who's first? I believe sure. it's Kurt. Should I go kite these bastards? Make, make them walk on the things and see if it's safe? Sure. Yeah. yeah. Okay. Good. Cool. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Ah. Ah. All, All right. right. My move or my other move. And you can see the light coming out of the thing there. Um, I can see, but all of all of it. More importantly, you see this being made completely of fire standing right here. And he's very big. Ten foot by ten foot normal. Being and squid. Oh, being fire. And fire. And being squid. Being? Being. being. Like human being. It's a being. great big fire. man made out of fire. Right. <laughs> burning man. <laughs> it's a burning man. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, he doesn't. Uh, he is not hindered by the fact that the uh, fire is that the walls are squishing him in, uh, because he's fire. made of fire. He just changes, changes shapes, but he's coming down that hallway. <clears throat> awesome. Towards or towards them or towards us? Towards towards the scrub. Shot spot. I need some help. Who's there? You. Uh, yeah, but I like this spot. You guys should follow me. Yeah. Uh, move me down six. What type of spell is snowball? What type of spell? Like uh, kind of wizard, sorcerer, class. druid. Uh, wizard. Why can't the druid have snowball? Because it's a wizard spell. <laughs> a sorcerer spell? Yeah. Maybe it's only on the wizard list. I'll say a druid can't have fireball. I think a few people have already learned snowball. The sorcerers have learned snowball? Yeah. 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 Okay. Well, evidently it's, it's also on the sorcerer. So it's with sorcerer. With sorcerer. Okay. What if I'm a, 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 a fire domain cleric? <laughs> well, technically, fire domain clerics can't have access to fireball. So. Right, so then he's saying, so why can't that snowball? 
Uh, yeah, with Sorcerer. Yeah, that's it. Druids don't have Firewall, right? No. They have Firestorm, though. Yeah, cool. So you just need Snowstorm. <laughs> okay, you just moved six? Yeah, um, so we do another six one with a diagonal going back towards uh, this wall here. Like that? Yeah, that should work. Alright. Who's after the nail flag? B flag. B flag can't do anything. You gonna ready anything? Wait for Steve to move. I'm waiting for Steve. Yeah, what? Is that, yes, yeah, so in here, I think. Root rack. Right over there. Put elemental there. Where? Right there after B flag. So it's a large fire elemental? Mm hmm. Yeah. Or the kind that comes in 5th edition? Oh. There's only one side. Yeah. Uh, oh, one I've seen people do uh, various versions, but that's just the only version. Isn't that in the uh, Tower of Books? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, there's like big and small and stuff like that. Right. But the base yeah. ones, yeah. Most of them, there's only one. Yeah, uh, all would definitely have hated this place. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. All will grab every stone he can and just throw. <laughs> <laughs> uh, just the fire being there, fire man, <laughs> the burning man. Uh, it, it gives out even more light. Uh, thirty feet of bright, and thirty feet of, of shadow. So he's lined up that whole room, uh, and he comes running down the know? hallway. Did you want to play hands on Steve? Yeah. I have 25 hit points to no one. He's going to do much more. It's not 20. Okay. After he just starts. Yeah. He didn't do anything else. Might as well. And you're sitting here talking. What the hell is an artillerist? He doesn't make a tune. An artillerist? Bad fire. Apparently, Fireball is on the Sorcerer Wizard. It's a light domain spell, the fiend, warlock, and artillerist. And we don't know what that is. So, uh, but he can reach here. Come on, Rich. So he takes a swing. Cool, do it. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> of course. Uh, notice he's uh, fighting in a five foot area there, and he's not hindered by it because he's all made of fire. Yeah, love it. That's great. <laughs> I'm excited. I fire, I go where I want. I go where I want. I think he can fit through keyholes. Uh, Very large keyholes. Yeah. Um, so great. Is not up next. So great. Um. Too much door. Is he an No, he's an elemental. I think you can run me up the pole 12. He's, you run him up the pole 12. I didn't grow up with this, you know. I, he I just told you he's made up. <laughs> <laughs> can you run him up the pole? Yeah, yeah. yeah. One, two, oh, three, four, five, six, seven. Can't eight, eight, grapple him. And stuff like that. How far? Doesn't have any moment. Not enough vulnerabilities in this game, you know? Right, which is why I think they should have cold vulnerability. Exactly. Right. They have yeah, that. Doesn't. <laughs> <laughs> okay, uh, so Togrek just runs down the hall, try yep. to help out. Yep. <clears throat> I'm going to follow along. Cool. Could be right next time or behind. Yeah. I'll go there. Um, give or take. Uh, and then Steve. 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 He's got a speed of 40. Yeah, you went Steve from the for you? Can he get there? Can you think he'd be able to bite can the... He, no, but can he get... I get my lance... No, that, that's the other guy, right? Do I have to say I'm reading that? I think yes, he's you did. Yeah, oh, he okay. decided to do... I'm going to do my lance! Nope, you did a lance. I did my lance. Just come stand right behind... I'm going to go... How far can you go? Yeah, you went 40 there, uh, but you can go double if you want to stand right behind him so that you can ready to lance in the future. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. So you're out there seeing him length. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because yeah. Steve can do 80 if he doesn't if he doesn't bite. So Steve can hold his action? No, he doesn't he used his action to move again. Oh yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then the yeah, fire doors. So they have one. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Holy crap, these guys are fast. Wow. Well, okay. But yeah, they move 30 and they, they move just in double move, so. These are scary dwarves. They're fast and they have fire. Oh, come on. Because they're. Still a bunch of them. <laughs> <laughs> Please, they're still in our. They're still scary dwarves. <laughs> <laughs> I think they got no beards. <laughs> Ugly. <laughs> All right. Who's after the fire dwarves? Damn it, I just saw a spell all over the way up. That's me. I'm going to have smack the fire. Can I use the chill touch to see? Go up there. The uh, chill touch does necrotic damage. Cool. <laughs> I'm trying to. Yeah. I got a 22 to hit. I'm going to do the second one because I know. Uh, and way more than that. 22 is good. Poison to me? Yep. Okay. Cool. Yep. Low armor class. And uh, the heat jumping off the fire elemental does nine damage to you. Total? Yeah. I had a try. Oh. Did you have a try? Yes. Let's see if it does a try. So, 11 total. Okay. And how much was your damage? Um, well, you're taking 50 cold. Because I had uh, I didn't need it. Oh, is it only a melee attack now? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I'll next round. Maybe. Uh, anyway, well, yeah, I'm going to do the damage for your... Okay, that's a... Four shots. Where? That's fine. Yeah, he keeps bouncing off my foot. 32 damage for the fire elemental. Did you look this up already in your... your, your... No, I'm making you look it up. You may get it so you look it up. <laughs> It's I want to say, I want to select like the fire elemental into my weapon. Yeah, that would be, that would be dope. Would be cool. <laughs> that would be dope. <laughs> uh, then comes the nail All right, uh, move me to where I have, where I would actually be able to see the uh, fire elemental. Like, there? Yeah, yeah that'll work. That's good. And I will toll the dead fire elemental. All right. DC 16, wisdom based. Wisdom. Surely he's not even good at that, right? He passed it. <laughs> okay. I'm done. This is extremely dangerous because of the dice. Actually, you know what? Screw with the. <laughs> Actually, no, no, I cast a spell. Yeah, yeah I, I cast two spells. Damn it. Yeah, no, wait, it was a cantrip. Yeah, it was a cantrip. Oh, then no, you can't. Oh, okay. if you do a cantrip as your action, you can do a bonus spell action. Oh, okay. Then uh, I will go ahead and bring out the uh, spiritual weapon. Want to put it right on him? Right there. Yeah. You put it right in it because I made a fire. Yes. Now that'll work too. You know, just chip away at the dwarves in the back? Uh, uh I can't okay. cast that far back. Oh. I'm actually, let me go check that. If it's 30 feet, then yeah, I'll do it behind, but I think it's only 20. Mm -hmm. uh, they can bonus action move 20 feet. I think that might be why I'm getting confused, but let me be certain real quick here. Be play attack. You think that's a magic weapon? She's going to do the attack, and then it'll be a be play. Can I help her? Yeah, that's good. You can lance him. Can I lance him now? No, it's a, it's a magical it's a spell. I know. Okay. I mean, yeah. It's forced damage. Can yeah, I do it with the Divine Smite? Yes, you can throw some Divine oh, Smite in there. Okay, but you want to roll to so see if you hit him. If you miss, don't divine smite. If you right. hit him, okay. divine smite. smite. All right, so I can do 60 feet. So I'll go ahead and put it right behind wow. the fire elemental. The right there. No, I still wouldn't be able to hit the fire elemental. So oh, I'm going to put like in their back. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. And then, doesn't matter. I'll just put it here in the wall. Yeah. Well, you know. And <laughs> there's an eye. There's an arm sticking out of the wall with a big axe. With an axe. Mm -hmm. Okay, and you're going to hit the fire elemental. Not only is there an arm sticking out there, it's flicking the bird too as it's swinging its axe. Nice. Because it doesn't really need it, it's just for effect. <laughs> uh, so, attacking the fire elemental, that is a 17 to hit. That's a hit. Okay. Ooh, max damage. 14. I mean, 12. Sorry. Sorry, it's all plus 4. So 12. <laughs> so, 44 damage for the fire elemental. Just right here. And then comes V Flay. And V Flay is going to poke him with a lance. lance which is now a magic lance. Because if it wasn't, it wouldn't work. You were very lucky. Oh, <laughs> <yeah>. <laughs> cool. 
That's a hit. How much divine smite? Divine smite! One. One. Because if we do that too, we can do picking it. Two. Mm-hmm. One D8 for each spell level against first. Maximum of five. Mm-hmm. So if you do it at a fifth level one, you I only five. have, but I only have like three. Oh, I've got three here. And, wait, three here and three here. Oh, dude, we can just do. I'll just do two. I'll do it two. I'll do it so two. you got your D12 plus two D8 plus your new modifier, which is plus six or something. Wait, and this is plus nine. No, no, the, the damage edition. For craft one? Uh, oh, plus six. Yeah. yeah, plus six. All right, so we'll go six. All right, so we're doing that. So two levels. Your mark of one of your two level two plus. Yes, I just did that. So Ooh. we'll do the eight, and here's ten. So 18 plus 6. 24. 24. Oh, Roll another D8. And because then, it's a at, base damage for divine spine is 2D8. And then oh, okay. an additional one for each. Okay, one more. So one more. Eight more. Oh. Eight more? Three, Three more. more. 71. 71. And then and we do it again? You get to uh, attack me the second time. All right, so attack again. Now, if you use, the, now if you use your smite. We still have to do the G twenty, right? It's, 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 yeah, it's marking off another slot. Seventeen. So another die. You hit him. Okay. Do you want to divine smite this one or just regular damage? Dude, I think I'm just regular damage. So do you. Wait, if regular divine smite at first level is only is two D eight. Yeah. Okay, we'll just so we can do two. Okay. So we'll just do at regular uh, first level. Level. One. level. Oh, okay. Yeah. So we'll just do that because we have like four. Of them. Oh my god! That was Nine plus six, fifteen. And it's gonna add up to eighty-six. Okay. Fire elemental. The fire elemental runs through your square, setting you on fire. What? Mm-hmm. Wow, that's, that's not that, good. Uh, <clears throat> what did I say? I don't know. I can't remember. I'm looking at. Shield it. Holy oh, crap! Okay, grab the book. What's fan cast? <laughs> There's no set. There's no set. Nothing. You're on fire now, and you take six damage immediately, and you'll take six damage at the start of each of your turns until you put the fire out with an action. I'm, I'm weird. I, like, I have armor made of ice on me. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> that's it. And, and, and then he smacks C. Doesn't the elemental take damage? From it's not the ice armor attack. Maybe okay. it's not man attack. Uh, it just set the ground on fire. Damage. Wow. Twenty-six. What are you the AC of fifteen? Okay. Uh, he hits him. So Steve takes eight damage now, and now Steve is on fire. Eight. Can I get shield that? No. Oh no, I actually rolled too high for you. Uh, no, no, that's not right. That's not right. Okay. Yeah, you're right. No question. So, is. Okay, there... that's horrifying. And then with his other hand, he swipes at V Flay, but misses. So, Steve took eight damage and it's all fire. Hmm. <laughs> right, now I'm going to jump in my fucking water spell. <laughs> now that I've read to the fire island, where's my water spell? <laughs> I was gonna read the wall of water. <laughs> and I got distracted with a divine spider or something. Yeah. Uh, okay, that's the first fire element. Uh, now we're at Toker. I'm gonna get it, get it out. shoot him in the face. <laughs> or whatever. <laughs> <laughs> Back of the head, face, right. chest, whatever. Yeah. And jump. And jump. And jump. And jump. And jump. More damage. And I missed. Oh, you always miss one. So that's why I have three. <laughs> yeah. Rolling a one doesn't work. Ever. <laughs> 18 on the die. That's a hit. Um, 21 points of damage. All right, and your arrow causes him to fizzle out in a little ball of flames. Okay. 
Um, he disappeared, I would think, because he was just fire, and now he's not. Um, but don't forget, uh, Scro and Steve are on fire. You gonna run around and shoot some more or something? Well, yeah. I mean, I can, I can run up and uh, I can get in this line here. Get a line on those guys. I can shoot one of the doors. Yep. Got one more shot left. Cool. Um, sixteen plus seven is a hit. Yes. Uh, 18 points of damage. I was trying to say, I took a really significant effort, and I was like, I don't care. <laughs> 18 points of damage on the front door. Um, who's after Chokrat? Rurak. Go over and see if you can extinguish him. Yeah, can I use my action to extinguish him? Uh, yep. You're gonna put out Steve how, how or Scro. I'm gonna put out Scro. <laughs> okay, Scro attack. How big it was? Careful though, uh, patting on that ice on. Don't hit him too hard, then it'll be a man. Use a shirt or something. Station. What? Press the digitation to put out the fire? Yeah. yeah. But that would be an action anyway. Yeah, I know. But you just pat it out. I'm just gonna... But if you weren't right next to him, then you could just press the digitation to put it out. Or okay. Mage Hand to put it out. Good to know. Mage Hand. Mage Hand. Mage Hand. Mage Hand. Mage Hand. Okay, so I then... Really? Maybe. That was... Came up with an action. Yep. Anything else? There was Steve. Steve. Steve guys just put himself up. Rub up against the wall a bit. What happened to Stop him when he roll. died? <laughs> oh, is he dead? The fire elemental? Yeah. I killed him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so Steve puts himself up because he can't do anything anyway. Right? Yeah, right he, he can't do anything? Yeah, because right. he's, well, he's stuck in there. Right. Yeah, put himself do up. Do I have to get him off this thing? Yeah. Oh. yeah. You guys just, you know, tricks and stuff. And you lift one leg and he rubs it against the wall and then you go to the other side. Can I just keep playing my hand? <laughs> that won't be your turn. That'll be yeah. your uh, Okay, so we're going to have to see if it's the fire drawer. So the fire drawer is going to run forward and we can get two up in here to attack with the. So the first one tries to hit throat and gets 21. <laughs> <laughs> so the second tries to screw. Then he gets him. I'll take it. You take twenty-five. <laughs> you take twenty-five. Well, that's when we already had eighteen on him, so Ooh, that kills him. No, was, the first one missed. The eighteen would miss. Oh, okay. So uh, I'm doing a D8 and a D6. So, so you take uh, eight damage, and he takes twenty-five. Sounds like a If you just did one less, I could take one more hit and do 25. <laughs> <laughs> um, and they only attack once. Sad. Gotta check that now. I screwed up the angels. <laughs> <clears throat> so that's, uh, that's it. They're all jumping up and down. Pull your own head up. No, they can't speak English, so they can't they speak common, so you don't know what they're saying. Really? This is a wild game? <laughs> really? <laughs> uh, so who's up after the Scroach. Scroach. So the melee attacks? I was just blasting twice in the face. From with disadvantage because you're yes. firing. Second shot. Okay. I got another one. <laughs> 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 nope, nope. Don't want. <laughs> okay, now split here. All right. Yes. Uh, I will go ahead and. Next time. What you need to do? They move to your square, so if you want to move to their square, that's fair. Wait, did I kill one? Not yet. Not yet. Did I kill one of the other bastards? I think you did actually. Cool. That guy comes out like <laughs> <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Hey, wait for me, I'm your dead ear. Okay, um 
I'm going to go ahead and attempt once more Toll the Dead on the one with 18 damage on it. Next time. He fails. Yes. Next time, what you need to do is go to attack and disengage. Three, three take days worth. One yes. step back, shoot them, and then step forward. <laughs> I forgot how to do that. 19. I'm usually just staying at 30. <laughs> Damn it. Just shy. <laughs> 30. They're 39, if I remember correctly. 39. Yeah. They said 37. Almost got it. All right. Uh, do you want to move around or anything? I have to. Oh, uh, no, don't forget the spiritual weapon. About to say, I don't want to do that, but yeah, I will move the spiritual weapon so we can weapon. attack that guy. Yeah, and finish him off. Yeah. Eight. Okay. Crit. Son of a bitch. Hey, what happens? What? Because I can't, I can't can suck his soul. No, I think, I think you should get an adroit spiritual yeah, weapon. So, oh, do yeah. we? Do we find yeah, I don't know if we agree on that. Yeah, it, it'll be for for the spell, though, not for the weapon. All right, so I'm doing a minimum of six damage. Yeah, so he's dead. dead. So roll another d20 to see if you can improve your spiritual weapon. Nineteen. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> <laughs> the polar opposite. <laughs> well, it doesn't make it worse, so you're fine. It's ridiculous. Yeah. yeah. I'm like, where are the dead ones? Oh, yeah, that's the first one. <laughs> Uh, okay, and then after nail split comes be play. Now there's a guy standing two ways so you can land some. Oh, okay, cool. So can I do that with them? Um, is his uh, great webbing style doing nothing for him right now? Remember that lets you re-rolls the ones and twos. Okay. So if you roll a one or a two on your D12, you can re-roll it. But only on the D12. Only on the D12. Okay, D12. okay I'll just play him with the lance then. Just play him? He's already, here he got, he's already got 25 damage, by the way, so he'll yeah. probably be wasting a mic. Oh, okay, so yeah. then, sorry, I, just, I just do the lamps. Just, okay, yeah, 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 definitely. So just roll a ticket. Alright, let's see if it's 17 on there. That's good. And it's a d12 plus 6. 6 plus 4 is 10. 10 being the 35, it will have to hit again. Alright, do it again. One's not working. One's not good. Yeah. So that didn't work. Mm-hmm. And then Spectre. The DM's rolling well. The Spectre. Not, that's never good. Well, probably should do that. There's a spot right there. Where he you said you can go through the wall. She looked at me. I should just went ahead and did this. Start shooting him ah. back. Oh wait! No. I should go hundred car on him. What action? You yeah. should have done that. You want to go ahead and cast the bonus yeah, section? Yeah, we'll do that. I wonder where we can do that. That was so funny. Okay, so you, you have a hunter's mark, and as soon as that guy dies, you can move it to another guy. <laughs> Which you're going to have to get. The hunter's mark actually is going to do a D6 damage. Oh, you want to put it on the floor? Yeah. Did you die? Yeah. I mean, yes. But you can cast it now so that it's ready for the next time. I'll cast it now. Okay. Then maybe we'll quit forgetting. Well, you, you were the one that told me, hey. <laughs> you know what? 16. And the Spectre takes 3. I miss. Oh, you're right. You don't miss, you miss, so the Spectre doesn't take any damage. <laughs> uh, that's it. That's all the Spectre gets to do one thing? Yes. Okay. Uh, and you're going to stand there? He doesn't get to disengage. Yeah, yeah. Then Togrek. Togrek, there's a whole line of small dwarves on there. Oh, let's just a whole line. shoot him in the face. First one? Yep. Wanna go accuracy on that one just in case? Does a two miss? Don't listen to him, because yes. he gives you back your pie. Oh, he did a lot of damage? damage. Yeah. yeah. I'll just do a regular shot on him. Yeah, just in case you're all around all that number. I heard all the 19, but oh. he was gonna die. Yeah. yeah. He's dead. No damage Second him. shot. Second shot. Okay, for damage. Mm. And of course I rolled that one low. So that's uh, 12, awesome. and I will five. You could precision in me, you got a good chance there. Yeah. Actually, yeah, a bit more. Good. Five. You got yeah, it. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> um, so 
that's five, 22. 22 damage. And then third attack. Uh, that's a 16. So that's an easy one to get your much precision. So I will precision that one. Of course, I got that. Max damage, 23. Killing the guy. Woohoo! Targeting them. Use two of my superiority dice. How many of those do you have now? You don't know how long. Just five. Mm. And you go very fast. But there's two more to do. Uh, who's after Turbo? Rerat. Rerat. Wait. Steve's on fire. No, he's on fire. Steve put himself out. He did. <laughs> Did it on his last turn, so we remember it's rubbing it against the wall. Mm-hmm. But then somebody's letting it go. <laughs> <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Back to where I am. Three, four, five, six. Got it. So you're going to shoot from there? Yep, three across. Okay. 17 on the dot. That's 17. Nine. Nine. So nine damage for the front guy. That's nothing. That's what I thought you were doing. Uh, you missed it. Uh, okay. Then. All of Steve, but he wasn't really wanting to. So was there. this plan? Because if he hits, was this plan before the note broke showed up, or is this the counter to the note broke? No, it was planned before the note broke. Yeah. I don't think Steve can get any closer. I think he's blocked. That's when fire doors, they just happen to be me. Actually, yeah, because you're <laughs> Well, no, I mean, if they, if they attack them, they take fire damage. Oh, they're burning die. themselves up. Right? Yeah. They only have 5 HP, so right. you have a 50 so 50 chance on the first chance to kill them. For the first time, they die. And they only do one damage, so that'd be terrible. Uh, Steve's just going to hang. Um, I don't think he's going to have anything he can really do. Okay. I mean, I mean, he doesn't want to you, go. You could run, you know, squeeze through there and go up there and fight that thing, but then every time you hit it, it's taking damage, so. Yeah. It's kind of a non Steve friendly area. I wouldn't do that. Yeah, he doesn't have anything he can, like, Unless you're throw or nothing like that. Yeah, right? just keep starting with 26. And he's already taking a few. No, he's taking eight because I keep laying hands on him. Oh, yeah. She's that value, sorry. <laughs> it's not she loves Steve. She's a paladin. Yeah. What are you going to do? All right. Yeah, I'll just so Steve just hangs then. Then the fire drawers. Then the fire drawers can come around her heart. So we got one fire drawer fighting uh, Grit, which is Scroop. <laughs> and he misses. <laughs> and another fire drawer fighting the Spectre. Yep. Uh, he gets a 19. Yeah. And what kind of damage do I have to be doing to hurt the Spectre? I think I'm only going to uh, do fire, right? No, I'm resistant to fire and bludgeoning, piercing, slashing from non out magical weapons. Just resistant, though? Yeah. So it's just half of all damage? Yeah. From these guys. So 10, so you take 5. 5 for the Spectre. And then. Oh, yeah, let's go. Screw. There's a guy still standing in front of you. Disengage is a bonus action. Back up. He whacks you. Disengage? Ah, what? You missed. These are sentinel doors. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> sentinel doors. I blast them twice in the face. Okay. <laughs> Is that another fucking one? Yes. Yeah. <laughs> They're 50 50 on ones. <laughs> 20 hits. 20 hits, though. For 80 points of damage. 10 and 17, man. Yeah. Yeah, uh, get back. And then you get back. Alright, after Scrub comes, Nailfoot. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and start with Spiritual Weapon. Uh, Which one do you want to hit? The fresh one or the 17 one? Let's go after the ones that already got some damage done on him. Just go diagonal. I'm just going to put it right here in the wall. I was going to say, you could go diagonal and just be able to hit both. Oh, yeah. He can move it every time. Doesn't it take a bonus action to move? Yeah, it does. It takes so, a bonus action to make the attack, though, so it's the same either way. You're going to move and attack as a bonus action. Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's good. Okay. All right, so yeah, we'll go ahead and attack the one sword to get damage on him. And we will fumble. 
So no hit at all. <laughs> Another one. And that's a seven now, right? Uh, yes. It's seven rounds left on him. And then? Now for me, I'm going to go ahead and do a third level guiding bolt. Third level guiding bolt. On uh, that guy's already damaged. All right, and he's got cover. He does have cover. Yep. Is this the guy with already a plus one? Do you have a plus one guarding bolt, or is that the other? Uh, one? Yeah, so plus two on it. Plus two to hit. Plus two. Plus one damage. Uh, plus two to hit, plus one damage. Negate's got it. Okay, so. Bark. 15, 17. 17 is a hit. 17 is a hit there. Alrighty. And I get that as a third level, so Wait. that's. I'm yeah. sorry. You rolled a 15. No, you, you rolled something low and you added to it and then you added two for the thing and you only got 17. Yes. But you needed 19. That's what I thought. So missed, so. Okay, so I, I will go ahead. Got all pathfindery there for a second. Mm -hmm. You need to reduce those mods. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to go ahead and uh, burn my last channel of divinity. Okay, so then you do get a hit. So it's 27, so it's 66, which was well worth it. 27 points of damage. Oh, that does okay. Another dwarf goes dark. Dust. We have like, and another. <laughs> yeah. I didn't know we were raping me. I should say I was done. Sorry. No, I was uh, trying to figure out who's next on the chart there. And I couldn't remember. He really likes knocking that ball into my feet. Yeah. Well, <laughs> I'm not really doing it, but he's far away. He's here. Other than. Other than. Yeah, we'll go ahead with the javelin. Chuck him with the javelin. Right here, Jack. I have a question. So, can I lay hands on Steve? Nope. No. No. As a bonus action. Nope. No. Oh, okay. I don't know if that's going to help. It's nine. You're going to want to count her healing time. I only have. Three. Make sure she's not being Steve. <laughs> I keep laying hands on Steve. Yeah, I know. Uh, so, is a 16? 16 is a miss. Is it a big miss or is it a matter? Very oh, small one. one. Oh, one. Do you want to go ahead and precision it? I don't have a precision, do I? No. Nope. <laughs> 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 you can precision it. Yeah. But she wants to. If she did have one, she, she'd do it. Okay. okay. Uh, so you miss, and who's next? Specter. Yes. Yes. <laughs> yes. Specter just standing here, taking it. Uh, uh, Togrek. Togrek. Take care of this bastard. All right. Lunch. Give him the football. Maybe you have to move. That's fine. <laughs> <laughs> Showtime. Um. Well, that was only a 14, so shoot him again. Right. 16. One more time. I missed all three times. Oh my goodness. Wow. That's got to be a record. Okay. We can have to put a high armor class faster than the robot. No, he's switching high armor class. Well, the problem is, is this one's. Right on the edge where he's right. going for damage instead of right. taking the precision. If I throw a 19 armor class guy there, he's like, I'm going for right. precision. Right. 17 right. is right. Yeah. <laughs> It is, because I'm 50 50 to hit. Right. 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 But 50 50 and I missed three times, that's pretty bad. Right. And I actually think it's. Same. Uh, you need a 10, right? I need a 10. Yeah. Same yeah. thing. Yep. Yeah. Same thing. Yeah. 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 16. 16 to miss. 16. And then. Steve. Steve. Steve, do you want to get in the fire or are you going to hang back? Well, can I just jump in there and see if I can do some damage to the guy? Yeah. It goes 40. I might as well just do yeah. my whole. And it's only two, three, four. It's only 20 feet to get there. Oh, cool. That's all I need to do in the 20 foot thing. Oh, yeah. Right. Did you get it? Might, well, might, well, might as well pounce. All right, so then I just go ahead and. I know he's going to take damage, but that's okay if he dies. Squeeze and pounce. Yeah. 
So if you want to ask questions. Oh, anyway, sir, yeah. That didn't work with double pounds things, uh -oh. I only got it two. Okay. So which one? So just call them on the other one then. We'll call them and see. Yeah, that's a 14. So 14. C is plus? 14. 4? 4. So that's 8? That's 18, yeah. Okay, so then it's a D8. This is the bike of the ball. The bike of the I'm sorry. It doesn't matter, it's a D8 plus D. Yeah. So it's a D9. 9 points mm -hmm. But then you, you take things. some fire from when you bite him, the fire comes back and burns you for 10. We didn't bite him. We didn't claw. bite him. Can you claw him? Can you damage him? He takes 10 points. Okay, fine. You take 10 points damage. Okay. Do you want to bite him? I might as well. I could have eight rates. No, I already, didn't I already bite him? No, you claw, claw. Okay, you're right, you're right. I did the whole pounce thing. You have one bite left. Alright, so we'll do one more bite. Right. And probably we'll just hit me and the fight is losing, right? right. That's all I guess. Alright, he's good. No, you missed. Missed, so you don't get burned. <laughs> okay, who's after Steve? Uh, the, the bastard. Oh, so he's gonna hit Steve? <laughs> got him. Shit. Uh, okay. I got 24. Oh, this thing gonna work. And Steve takes 11 damage. Is that the end um, of Steve? Yeah. I don't know why you guys took on Steve. The end of Steve. Because he's easy to hit. He's also surprised given the number of heals you throw. <laughs> <laughs> Burn. Steve burns up until he disappears. Okay, I got a question here. Okay, well, you can. I have a question there. there. Yeah, well, I still have 20 yeah, points of healing in my pool. Good. Uh, 21 and 29. <laughs> Two weeks. That's an idea, T10. Yeah, that's. That's yeah, never noticed. Yeah. <laughs> uh, plus 12, so that's 22. So that's 31. Force movement. Drag him towards him? Yeah. Actually, that would be where you drag that towards him. Yeah, the yeah. diamond, yeah. And then? Nail split. Nail split. All right, then. So oh, weapons. This is, uh, I'll be doing that here in just one second. Okay. Uh, because we'll be fighting these creatures, Sacred Flame. Radiance. The description says flame like radiance. Yeah, so it's, it's still radiance. just radiance, yeah, right? It's just radiance. Yeah. Okay, good. Because I'm not healing these bastards. Fuck that. <laughs> I, was gonna, I was gonna say. No, like, sorry. Do we want to? Yeah, I've already, I've already put that one to the wayside. Dude, I was gonna say well, since there's one left and we're gonna pound the hell out of them, do we want to see if they're just immune to fire or fire heals them? They're just immune to fire. There's, I mean, that's meta knowledge, but. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The whole negative energy thing, the healing undead. That's that's his own rule. In this yeah, thing. I know. Mm -hmm. All right, so we'll do the spiritual weapon first. No, yeah, there was the iron realm healed on a uh, fire. Mm. Yeah, yeah, but that's your own thing. That's oh, that's no, that's no, that's that's way the iron bombs. Am I at like a plus call? Uh, lightning, <laughs> if memory yeah. serves. Okay, good. Yeah. Uh, so you guys just wire and kill the wizard. Never <laughs> got the lightning bolt. Bolt is on call. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay, so I missed with spiritual weapon. I'll uh, go ahead and drop it down to six. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to go ahead and sacred flame that guy. Okay. Uh, so I need a 19 because uh, cover from stroke. Right? Yep. Just <laughs> a little bitch. And dead 18. <laughs> Oh, I can't so it's not like I, I, I waste the spell, so. Yeah. Uh, then after Nail Split comes, no way. My 10 away can I just go ahead and lance him? Uh, yeah, your 10 away, you can just go ahead and lance him. Alright. Sure. How, 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 so do I, uh, can I add, um. He, he's already had 31 damage, so it's yeah. probably just easy to hit him. I said that last time, and then look what happened. And you rolled really poorly, it's not my fault. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Remember, you get to reroll one once in two, so if you get a three, you're going to kill him, and if you get a one or two, you get to roll again, and unless you get another one or two... <laughs> so, Your odds are pretty so good. So I got 19 on the back. Right. And, and then 12 plus six. 12. 12 plus six. Nine. 
Fifteen. Fifteen kills. All right, then. So and do we we don't see anything dead. in this area here? Mm -mm. In here? If I move to here and look down there, do I see anything okay. there? Nope. We investigate that area. Any other batches? Cool. Right, so you're finished looking around. There's no everybody else here. Which way do you want to go now? No, stop him. Cool, like. No, yeah. We're not going to find anything normal. until we get to the drop temple, I guarantee you. It's just, all melted. Just normal weapon shirt added to the bottom. Spears in the pile. <laughs> Back in the pile. Okay. <laughs> You're going to be <laughs> selling a ton of money. <laughs> Wasn't planning to collect these ones, but okay. I don't think it matters where we go. He's gonna random roll it in. Hey, see, you know what? Yeah. Screw it. We need to start. Five. I gotta do this right. That's right. Heads, spears. <laughs> All right, we're good. Ooh, we can mark our, uh, you know, path. Yeah. Path. Our breath <laughs> coming. We can yeah. come in. We chuck it. Door skull. All right. Well, cool. I'm happy with this. Well, it won't be skulls. It'll be body parts. Uh. Yeah. It's just an arm that's in the <laughs> Yes! Yes! We're doing that! Where'd you roll? That's close. <laughs> Almost found the temple. <laughs> oh. Oh. Uh, no using fire dwarf white parts to mark way. Uh, you come into a, a skinny hallway here, so everybody's going to in single file. Uh, I don't know what block there. Where do you want the... Uh, you're going to do a... A what? The more cold bastard. More cold and stuff. <laughs> where, you, uh, where are you putting your... Uh, Who's it? Uh, front, uh, back, middle, front. front you. Oh, front. front. Right. Front. Okay. You roll 3d6 getting an 18, is that what happens? No. Nope. Before I remember. Oh, you got to get a 3? Yeah, but there's one fire, so I'm going to have burned down. Okay. You hear that, the excited flaming, and you recognize it as it's one of those fire dudes. Everybody roll for an initial check. Okay. <laughs> oh, thank God I had my, my advantage. <laughs> I rolled a two. Oh, I rolled a one and a ten, so. Don't we have the bow of no one can be surprised? I believe so. No. no, we don't. That's with the ranger, I think. It's with the ranger. That's with the Mahakam. Uh, uh, That's with the paladin. That's with the Hawkgoblin. Is that the same dude? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> No, the, the, the Paladin's a uh, goblin, I think. I got eight on that. Yeah. Um, so, Scrub goes first. Alright, I was looking up, trying to think of like a big old blasty spell. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm going to do that. Carrot, aww. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's enough. You put this back here in front? I can I can put up a shield that stops living from going through if you want to uh, be able to blast him from behind the shield. I was gonna run around the corner and then hold my action to blight the motherfucker. Alright. And I want I wanna be in, in the hallway. You're in the in more towards that hole. Diagonal, diagonal, diagonal. Away from the fire elemental. That's as far as I get? Yeah, because you're going to go through this game. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So. Cool. Hold on, actually. Blight him out of fire. Yeah, blight him when he comes through. Yep. Alright. Blight actually work on him? You cry? Ah, okay. Well, there we go. And nail split. Okay. Now, now, okay. I'm not going to take half play. But if it was me, the marching order would be the same as the initial order. <laughs> 
Yeah. <laughs> okay. So, one, two. This is five the whole Ah, okay. Okay. One, two, three, going through the spectrum doesn't count as anything, right? Nope, it still counts. It does? Yeah. Shenanigans! I was thinking of that too. Hold up. If you can move in. Where is the other thing? Where? Let's confirm this real quick. <laughs> yeah. Uh, the spectrum can move through other creatures uh, and objects as if it were difficult terrain. So, yeah. uh, Oh, so you can totally move through the spectrum, but it's difficult terrain. Just like your friends. Have we been in court room this whole time? Hey, move on. <laughs> I don't know if I'm real. So you just want to run uh, six, or you want to go in behind? Get out of the way, basically. <laughs> yeah, I think I will go behind Scrope. Yeah. And... I will use the scroll, which I had been intending to do each time. Oh no, I did use the scroll. Okay. Oh, nope. Yeah. Do that. yeah. All right. right. So I will go ahead and bring spiritual weapon out, and he can go up to sixty feet. You have to see it though. That's the question. Can I see him? Mm, no, I can't. I can see him. Mm, shut by. Wait a minute, you had more movement. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Wait, you had to double move. You can see his bonus action. Bonus action. Yeah, this is bonus action. Yeah, then you can see him. Okay, alright, perfect. Then we'll go ahead and put it right here. Yeah. You can yeah. certainly see the glow. Definitely see the glow. Okay, let that break glow up. There he is. Okay, tell him. Spiritual weapon! Ooh, 17 on the die. Actually, this guy's easy to hit, isn't he? Yeah. Okay, well, uh, just for uh, documenting purposes for, for the film, I got uh, 25 here. <laughs> 25. <laughs> How much uh, damage do you do? I do 9 points of damage. 9 points of damage. And he is ready for a 12 a day to come. come and they're wearing beef leg. I don't just... Can I get a line? I don't want to get a line. Stand back in the corner. I can't get up. I mean, I can only go... Um, one, one, two, two three, three, four, five, six. six. This is as far as you can go and do something. You could go 12, but then you'd be blocking everybody else. Um, or stand in the corner over here. If I stand in the corner, you can back there. I can't, still can't see him, but I can... He's, he's going to come in the room. I know. I guarantee you. Because he doesn't worry about small things. So right. Because then I'm adding, right? If, I'm, if I go there, I'm adding. Well, I yeah. can hold uh, my. Math how far away? No, you won't be able to hold anything because you have to okay. double move. Yeah. Okay. So just go ahead. How many there. gallons of water is. I can't do. A one foot thick, 20 foot ring in diameter, 20 feet high. If I. No. I can't see anything. <laughs> I can't get to a place where I can see. Put if I suck that geometry. No. Okay, <laughs> so. Use your bonus action to put the. Um, what? It's a ring wall. Is right. One, misty, step. One, misty step. Misty step. What the heck is that? Uh, you With the phone section move 20 feet. Oh. 20 or 30? Mm, no. Look at it. Alright, you just go there for now. So is it uh, 20 feet? After play comes the spectre. Inside the ammeter, so the wall faces outward and makes a 20, a 21. So put ring wall up to 20 feet in diameter, 20 feet high, and one foot thick. D and D geometry. Uh, circle of twenty radius minus circle with nineteen radius. That's what I was. That's what I was saying. Is is it on the inside or the outside of that twenty? Maximum twenty. So the edge of the wall is at twenty, and the interior of the wall is at okay. nineteen. Okay, that's what I was asking. This is teleport for thirty feet in an occupied space that you can see. That you can see though. So that's the problem. Know. All right, so you just run around the corner. Uh, Spectre's move. Spectre. What's the Spectre doing? Ah, it flies out there and uh, you're going to hold an action to, to... <laughs> And then, turn right. Um, yeah, run me up and 
put me toward the back so I can shoot him when he comes through. Yeah, there you go. Quite a That's a 12 there. Yeah. Six wouldn't do any good. Uh, no I think yeah. so, because harm is a And you're right. Six. Yep. <laughs> Hi name. guys, what's going on? <laughs> We're all waiting for this guy to come around the corner. So he comes around the corner. Uh, but, right there is when you combine them. Uh, the ring is 30 feet, so that's also a good thing. I, I can't see him. You can see him. Oh, yeah. yeah. You, you, got, you get sign on him, you got rage on him, you are good. Contact. Contact. You won't by chance be magical plants, would you? No. Just an elemental. Just doing my thing. I got 12, so I think I failed. Yeah. Thirty-five. You were the only one holding, right? Yeah, oh, correct. I had a double move. Yeah, I had a double move. I did, I did no move, and I did my four, five. Uh, Spectre gets oh, his. Spectre. Spectre. Spectre was holding. Yeah. yeah. Um. Yeah. Plus. Is it more than ten? <laughs> yes, it's nineteen. Four, but special thing with the. You're good. Hit. Okay. Yeah. That's the cross, right? Yes. So, ten. Alright. Uh, hit point maximum reduction. I don't think I'm there. He's like a heal. So. Uh, he, he sets the spectrum on fire. One point in. Is he on fire? Do I need an action? Because that's garbage. <laughs> I'll just phase into a wall real quick. Right. <laughs> so, yeah, just remember to step in the wall and back out on your next move. Uh, but then he's going to go ahead and attack. Stroke. Uh, because he loves that ice damage. Uh, Have we come up with that number yet? Getting there. All right. <laughs> 2,450 cubic feet. I'm getting, working on the math to, you know. Gallons. Yeah. Just curious. <laughs> <laughs> I understand how you're going to deploy it, but I mean. It's a ring wall. <laughs> yes. <laughs> and he will step through one cubic foot. It doesn't splash. All right, I, I want to bring this question. So what you need, is, what you need I mean. is how much water is in the ten foot by ten foot area that he passes through with a one foot thick wall in gallons. Right, no, I mean, <laughs> that's that's for Petey, and Petey's coming in soon. Okay. Mm -hmm. What uh, what are you what are you gonna do, Mister Cap? Oh, it's my turn. <laughs> I'd, I'd, uh... 18,327 gallons. Oh. 18,000 points of damage. <laughs> I can put it all right on him. <laughs> uh, I'm going to try this. I'm going to disengage back up. Is this a set, bitch? No. Okay. Last one, play. 16 each. Uh, okay. Yeah. You're just gonna step out and then step back? Yep. Okay. Uh, 15, 25. 25 more damage, so he's at 79. And then. Wait. I run this way. Yep. I don't take that backward step, I just keep running into this. Like, nope, I keep running. Okay, I'm going to make <laughs> One, two, three. Four, five, six, like that. Mm-hmm. Okay. And then shoot. Then you shoot. That, yeah, you shoot. Yeah, that's right. <laughs> okay. And then we're at the else play. Mm-hmm. Well, he's got 79 hit points, so I, at this point in time, it would be overkill for me to use harm on him. Yeah. 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 So, I will go ahead. Huh? I'm going to touch his fire on You don't have to touch. 
Oh, it's not. 60, 60 feet. Oh, I'm thinking of inflicting it. Yeah, you're thinking of inflicting it. I'm not touching the thing. <laughs> Maybe, but then. Um, I said that you fool. Able... <laughs> I said the fool. <laughs> Anywho, uh, we're going toll dead then. Uh, that's a range attack, though. It's no, it's not a range, it's the same. It's the same. Yeah, so I need to uh, say it's 16. Yes. Oh, no, this one's wisdom. Say. Total dead's wisdom. Wisdom. Nope. Alright. And you're doing 3d12 with that? 3d12. Right? <laughs> 20 points of damage. 99. How's that bullshit? <laughs> These ones are huge, he's doing three of them. That's only because he's hurt. If yeah. he weren't hurt, it'd be 3d8. Every monster gets hurt. <laughs> so they're there for hurt. It's 3d10, it's the first level spell. <laughs> That's also bullshit. <laughs> At least you gotta touch him, though. Guiding right. bolt. If like you wounds, touch. You yeah. gotta hit, and then you get the damage. Oh, except it's saber for nothing, though, right? It's right. saber nothing. So as long as I make a saving throw, that never takes. I was the same thing with my sacred flame. The same thing. Same, same thing. Nothing. Okay. Uh, nail split. Oh, did you want to move this to try and just uh, in case? Actually, I think I'm going to keep it there for this reason. Uh, well, I don't know where the hell those creatures are going to be, where the fire dwarves are coming from. So, uh, and you're out there, ass hanging in the wind right now. So you got your axe buddy helping mm -hmm. you out. Be flag. Be flag, buddy. I'm sorry. Step sorry, forward, sorry. taking Lincoln. Look at total. Total it. No, I don't know. Because there's a lore. What? Okay, five nice. plus Lance. You got that magic Lance now. Nine, 14. That's a hit. Oh, sweet. <laughs> so if I can I do that, uh, I'm going to go ahead and put Divine Smite on him. No, uh, he's, he's good. Nope. Oh, no, yes, he's, he's good. really good. All right, it's okay. Just do the D12 plus 6. Six plus 13. Kills him. So if you hadn't, I would have. So then you go. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so, how many points, uh, hit points does the fire elemental have? Well, only 99. Has she did how many points? And how much damage did you get? 13. 13. 13. So, 112. Okay. 112. <laughs> Okay. So you guys put this one out. I mean, put it in. <laughs> yep. You did. You put him out. Of his, of his misery or we just in general? Okay. Yeah. So uh, you go and you don't find anything else in this area. Oh, uh, drop the thing. Nothing. Please. All right. Is it? That's all we got? No, yeah. no answer? We heard them. No, we didn't. Yeah. We didn't? I guess we heard, no. the, oh. we heard the fire element. Yeah. Mushing noise. Oh, fire okay. Elemental being inside the vessel. Okay, I get it. <laughs> I get it now. Wicked. Trixie. False. Trixie. False. <laughs> Where do you want to go now? <sighs> well, shit. That was yeah, let's, go. Okay. let's just go in initial uh, three. <laughs> I'm going to go out door three. Three foot long, ten feet wide, and ten feet tall. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Say that again. Three foot long, ten feet wide, ten feet tall. It's just, just 3,000 cubic feet. Yeah. Because this water actually like stays in Dissipates, yeah. Right, right. Did we oh, get it? Why don't you keep rolling doubles? No. I don't know. I forgot to do the Is that a four by now? Uh, I think it's a three by three, actually. It's supposed to be a three by three. Actually, it does seem like a four by three. Uh, yeah, I take the base off, it's a three by three. Mm -hmm. That's why we always have the base off. Oh, we'll see. Yeah, cause What's your, I just uh, found out this that this is a 10-foot uh, wide hallway, so how are you going to line up in this 10-foot wide hallway? Screw it, nail foot, B-flay, toe crack, root rock. Screw it. Oh, throw a spike right there, too. Toe flay. <laughs> Screw it. Did I toe flay? Nail <laughs> flay. <laughs> B-flay. Toe crack. 22, 4, 4, 1. Gallons. Ah! <laughs> and technically, that's not the back. Where does the spectre go? Mm, somewhere in there. Next to me, Sure. 
technically this is in the back because you've got the rest of the people following you. <laughs> it's not the backpack, but for this instance, it's backpack. backpack. But you know that the yeah, directly behind you is this Oh, group that group there. Yeah. They just have to stay far enough apart that they don't fall in. <clears throat> so now you hear the bad guys, and you recognize the sounds now. So you know that it's not only fire dwarves getting their shields and whatnot ready to go, but also another fire elemental. You might even try that. Oh, uh, yeah. I have not been. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can keep track of what we've encountered yeah, in which section, so. Yeah. Just for the experience. Part. The day he's not here, you should. I know, right? <laughs> I just realized I'm not keeping track. Oh, shit, I gotta go back in. <laughs> okay, so everybody's gonna roll on an issue check. Issue check. Issue check. Uh, no change. I rolled a two again. The fire element was 23. Easier arcane. I'm sorry, I love it. I just think our actions are So, uh, are you, uh, what's the script? Twitter. Oh, let me go first. To be you and fire element, face and down again. Hunger of her daughter in the uh, hallway. Yeah, I did that. There's some cold in that shit. Typical screen. You probably don't give a shit about No, it does. Typical screen still hurts me. I'm not like. Yeah. Yeah, I don't know why, but. He can get as small as he needs to be, but if it's typical screen, it's still difficult. Go all two dimensional. <laughs> Fire damage is half of that one here. Yeah. I don't know if you were born at the okay. end though. Uh, this is a complete random question, but it goes back to uh, Flo being on the ship with the cultists. How many of those cultists are women? <laughs> <laughs> I think all of them were. <laughs> but I didn't really check. <laughs> does Flo care? <laughs> oh, yes, he does. Flo's right. got some repopulating this year, so he's like, <laughs> I don't care. Look at those tiny teeth. <laughs> Take one for the team. <laughs> Actually, I'm just thinking of something really cruel. If you you read on the, the, the Dread Emperor from Book of Wild Darkness. I'm sorry, I don't know what that is. <laughs> Yeah, I'm gonna do the pick a big old twenty foot radius. Uh, that old the hallway right there. Yeah, in the the. Yeah. What? Our <laughs> twenty foot radius. Okay, you're gonna put a twenty foot radius thing out. And you're gonna put it where? Uh, come around that corner. Right? Like here ish. Uh, or you can move a little bit. A little bit over so that yeah. you might be able to see them. Yeah, I'll, I'll do a move in there too. Make it right here. 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 Or you Okay. I'm going to put the darkness up here. Only you can see in the darkness, right? And I will all just stand back and wait. Okay. Alright. So say if, if there's a way for you to see through and poke at them. No, there won't be a way for me to do that now. Well, him. For him, yeah. yeah I mean, he's, he's, he's that's, good that's what I was saying. Is, is, if he could put it to where he could see where they are now, but man. Yeah, we'll see what they do. Okay. Then comes Fire Elemental. Whoa, Fire Elemental goes before me? Yes. Yeah, right here. He's coming the other way. He's rolling. And we're hating. <laughs> I'm sorry, he was there. I had to use it. <laughs> <laughs> and then the split. All right. The split. I the go. Fire elemental came the other way. Okay, I so go last, right don't I? Damn. Shit. I'm just going to end up dropping this stupid thing, huh? Yeah. 
Yeah. Probably. It'd be great if you try to throw the dwarves kind of thing. Yeah, yeah. I could throw a wall, <laughs> I could throw a wall of stone in front of the fire element. Make him go back the other way. Yeah, actually I like that. Yeah. That's cool. Yeah, let's say so Fuck you. No, you don't get to go this way. Two, three, four, five, six. Okay. I will go to here. Keeping him out of the dark okay? Yes. This thing cuts off right here. So. Yes. All right then. And then I am going to cast harm. Harm on and the fire element range. That but is the same girl on that one. Uh, it is Constitution base DC sixteen. And fuck. Does he take any damage? Uh, he does take half damage on it, but still, I want him to take full. It's this is fourteen D six. I don't want to take half of it. <laughs> oh, I do half of fourteen D six. Who play your own deck? Your own Have them bench go run around that corner and stab it with their uh, stabby thing. Question is how much divine smite are you going to kick in this time? I know. I, do. I, mean, I, I just do like three, third level. Just dump it. Yeah. Is dump that it one, two, three, four? Uh, yeah. yeah. So I did 25, and he's only taking 22. <laughs> what? See? <laughs> Yeah. No one was in Anyway. Ooh, hard. <laughs> well, I roll. Yeah, well, I just want to go. Four twos, two threes, two ones. <laughs> He's still talking about his dice. You can go ahead and okay. hit him. <laughs> what is that to do? Hunter's Mark? Yep. Hunter's okay. Mark, transfer. And then that, I get to roll the D6. An extra D6. Right. Alright, so first we just take the hits. That's a hit. Okay. And you're putting in a level three divine level three smite, divine smite. Hunter's, mark. Okay, hunter's mark, and the lance. The lance is this. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Okay. We'll see if we can get Everybody busting out the dice tonight. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh. So the ones I get to be rolled? No, no, only the ones for the D12. The D12? Didn't roll the D12. Okay. So there's 10. Um, nah, this is only nine. Thank you. Thank you. Plus, plus six. Plus six. Twenty-five. So he's got forty-seven damage. Him you get to again. hit him again. With a sixteen. That's a hit. How Come much uh, divine smite? Do what I do in the third one? Oh, yeah. So yeah, I'll do that again. So we do that again. We do get that. Another third. You always get that one. All right. And you're going to add yeah. in four more for the level three divine spike? Yeah, we're going to need to. And the hunter's mark. Yeah, yeah that was the hunter's mark. Okay, we'll do that. Hunter's mark is Yeah. Okay. 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 Did plus you add a six? Plus six. Forty-four? Forty-four. That's a hundred. Uh, no. I mean, I have to put up a wall of stone. I may just shoot him in the face. <laughs> no, and then that way, as far as I can, but I want to. One, two, three, four, five, six. And then. That's back there. Don't forget to mark off two level three spells. Yep, I'll do it. And then this back there. Uh, Are you going to go fight him? Yep. Fourteen. Is it hit? That's 11. It's got a 100 mark on him. Is that Six for you. Six for you. Um, is that a 9? Is that a 9? Throw it right out. Uh, so, so you yeah, had 91, 91, you did 11 to him. 102. Two. Okay. All right. Pulling off by ten. It's because somebody did a bunch of damage. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, that killed. Him. Cool. Then the the eighties. Oh. You didn't drop the spell yet, so they run this way. Yeah. <laughs> 
what does the nine? Cast two hunger over dark. I get eight points out of it. No, eight times five. Yeah. You know what I'm thinking? <laughs> I'm thinking the next time those dwarves move, that uh, it's going to be perfect for a javelin of lightning. <laughs> You got all the action for that to happen? That's what I'm thinking. Alright. You're next though, right? Yeah, no. Nope. Right. next, yeah. Alright. Um, I'm here in uh down the light in that hallway. Yeah. Don't get my my dude in there. He's resistant, but uh, You'll be able to move him before. Can you heal him with some negative shit? <laughs> you should be able to move him before it what is before they move. I feel like you'll be able to work on downstrikes and undead. It's undead though, right? Yeah. No. Uh, it does. does it blow up the go through the thing? What? Yeah. They have that spell. You don't have that. Right. What? But he has a Nekara spell. And then you're going to have to No, undead can only heal with, uh, he does. Okay, I'm holding the Javelin of Lightning and the spell. Until somebody hits this point here. Uh, you're going to hold it down the lining until they all get in the hallway. Yeah. Since they're all going around the hallway at the same time. Yeah. Okay. And then. We're back. We're back. Don't stand in front of me. And I will say, don't stand in front of me, man. <laughs> yeah. I was thinking of just. So I, since I'm standing there with the you know, <laughs> lightning, lightning in my yeah. hand, you, you, <laughs> you probably got that message. Anybody injured at all? Oh, uh, yeah, I am actually. I still have damage taken. By how much? Uh, I got 10. What are you doing way over there? I'm a little hurt. You need. I've got 20 points of a. You can make it scroll. That's an emergency defibrillator shit. <laughs> get, get the hell. Yeah. How much are you down? Seven. Seven? Seven. Okay. I'll burn a first level. How Just much? Just put a cure wound. Oh, a cure cure wounds? Uh, D8 plus five. Yeah, uh, uh, sure yeah, so D8 plus five. You're full heal. Sweet. Ten, if that matters. Mm -hmm. Um, okay. And then comes screw. Yep. Look at the hunger of cards. No one wants to play in the tentacle. <laughs> <laughs> I can't see how anyone's surprised about that. Uh, and then I'll run over here, six. But that way it's farther. <laughs> <laughs> Three, two, one. Uh, six. Stand there right next to a bear. Here? Yeah. Uh, I hold an Eldritch Blast. You ever hold an Eldritch Breath? Yes, Eldritch Breath. <laughs> and you're going to wait for the lightning to go off? That sounds terrible. Yeah, I'm going to shoot a survivor. Right? Shoot a survivor. Yeah, and, and light, lightning will go off before yeah. he has another. Yeah. yeah. Fire Elemental dead? Yep. No way. Okay. Uh, I will prepare a Toll the Dead for when they are within range, which will be after his, uh, his, uh, yeah, 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 no, I'm going to stay right there. Stay right there. Just gonna stay right there. Yeah, I'm fine. Just stay right there. Uh, okay. And then V-Flay? Um. Did you want to? Can I move up? Six. Trying to get around the corner here, kind of thing? Or not. No, you just want to go one, one two, three, three, four. Oh, yeah, okay. Uh, like that. Yeah. Let's go over there and be ready with your lance. Yes. I mean, hold on a second. You can just like hold on a second. Anything, right? No. No. Okay. Has to be, <laughs> there's certain things that are specifically okay. bonus action. Can you do like a bonus action brand smite? Oh yeah. What? Brand new smite? Yeah. It's a bonus action. Mm -hmm. How long does it last? It's like a minute. Right? Oh, it's a minute. Small well, type. Oh. It's a special smite. Uh, 
Because the other smart speaker. I'll just uh, hold it in my hand. I got this um, really cool. They got a couple different smarts. I mean, Siri Spike is one of the models we can add. You're going to throw a javelin at a guy. Um, what do you want to do? Say it. Hmm. Just prepare to poke the guy. You could just prepare. Yeah, I have this large. Yeah. <laughs> you could just prepare to put it and move your yeah. hunter's mark on Danny one for next go. Somebody comes around the corner and hunter's mark him. Okay, the that first place is in hunter's mark. Well, then you should say, first person survives the rest of these bastards. <laughs> 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 Spectre, I move over. <laughs> Well, I'll come stand at the thing. Here. Wax and make them shine for After all this. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, after the channel lighting, we'll just run through the initiative. <laughs> uh, and then that leaves the uh, Azir. So they got run around the car. And when they're all here and have moved five, is when all, everything cuts loose. Okay, so I don't think I hit the last one. Okay, so it's just 46 for everybody, but they get a uh, deck save. And the save number is 15, because it's a Yes. Oh! Nice. I see, I see a two fives, sixes, and a, ten, a one. So that's uh, 17. 17. So with uh, having a round down. What is that? <laughs> They didn't make it. Okay. What made you get? 17. 17 for everybody. And then. I blocked it. I'll see if you don't block. Yeah, 29. For 16 points of damage. Please up to 33. Now bring him 10 feet closer. And it comes 10 feet closer. <laughs> and then it's right here. And then somebody else is going to get go. Okay. But they're not done moving. You'll get the next one. Well, no, I'm gonna hit that guy one. Because he had a hold action. Yeah, yeah I know, but yeah. also you had a hold action. Mm -hmm. yeah. Just you? Uh, as far as I had burned my action. If he survives a burn, you did a heal, yeah. right? Because you're yeah. after the mm -hmm. bad guy. Yeah, Rubrot heals, heals Crow. Okay. So you already, so you're the only other one holding an action besides the spectrum. But so you go before the spectrum. So. If he lives, I get a put a hunter's mark on him. If whoever lives gets a hunter's mark on him. Okay, so that's that's what she's doing. Okay, <laughs> you're going to hit that guy. Uh, uh told that was told. Is that in the range? Should have been range. Oh, okay. Twelve, sixty feet. It should be right on top of it. Let's double check just because I want to be certain. I actually have it saved right here. Sixty feet on the dot. Okay, so you get to tell the day. Oh. Don't have to wait for the next one. There's other ones coming, don't you worry? <laughs> I brought them closer to you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you were saying, oh, okay. You're gonna, gonna, I thought you were great. Right. I gotta do my thing. Yeah. You're gonna roll your thing. Unless I didn't make it. I didn't roll it, so I didn't make it. No, you did not make it. Uh, <laughs> wow, what a waste. 28. <laughs> yeah, that's totally nice. <laughs> All right, so, and now they've only moved five. So, six, seven, now the spectrum. Doesn't miss. Ain't none. So they all had to move more than six so they don't get to attack the spectre, but they're all surrounding the spectre. Now you can hunter's mark one. You want to get the first one? Okay. We'll just put a hunter's mark on him. And now it's Tokrak's turn. God. I think I <laughs> got to kind of shoot him in the face. Okay, this has got a hunter's mark on him, so if you want to just take out that row for her, then she would be happy to kill that guy. Alright. <laughs> Sounds like a good plan. I like it. Um, yeah, these are at that tough place. Let's go for damage. Go over damage. I'm target. 17. I hit that one. Yep. And they had 17 damage. I just erased it. 23. Mm -hmm. So he dies. Next one. 18 on the die, that's a hit. 
Um, 21. Chosen? Nope, wait, sorry. I'll say, yeah, he's got one left. left. <sighs> shoot the uh, uninjured one. I'll shoot the one behind him. They're mm -hmm. all injured. The relatively uninjured <laughs> one. Yeah. Yeah. The one that is close to death. Just give him. Shoot the other one. Um, 13 plus 7. Hit, probably a hit. For 20 points of damage. He's got two left. He's got two. <laughs> and and why weren't one and two when they did, so we're sticking with it. Right. Uh, okay, well, you didn't quite kill everybody. So then. Root rot. Root rot. Gonna burn somebody? No, I'm gonna ray of frost the, uh, <laughs> the guy with. Oh, and I'm gonna step back. Two on. HP. Okay. And that's um, 16 range-ish? It's less than 16. It's 90 range. range. Okay, and you're fine. Yeah. Two, three, so no coat of yet. Yeah. Or you wanna move? Well, to not have cover. Yeah. That's why okay. I stepped back. That's it. Then I got, then I yeah, I'm gonna have to shoot that guy because I ain't hitting that guy with cover. Yeah, two haircuts. You rolled two dice. Or one of them. Shoot the one over I'm gonna shoot the one in the yeah. front because I'm not gonna buy the difference between one and two. Doesn't matter. Take the easy one. Eighteen. Okay, it's a hit. Are you gonna do one? Uh, maybe. You can do at least two. So <laughs> hopefully. <laughs> And then are you going to step back? Yep. And then? Scrub. Scrub. I blast the one in the hallway. 19. Dead. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and what's the other one? 28. And hit. Or 12. So you hit 29. And after Scrub comes down, split. Did Reflay not get... Yeah, Reflay was before the Azir and held uh, Hunter's Mark. He just got this one, Hunter's oh, Mark. Okay. She, uh, might not get a, she might not get to actually take another turn if you kill him. I will go ahead and toll the dead on that guy, too. Toll the dead. What's the same number? I forgot 16. Right now. Okay. Probably dead. Uh, 24. So, yeah, he's dead. He's dead. You didn't get to Hunter's Mark anybody. So you never do the hundred mark before yeah, yeah. Okay. She couldn't see it. Yeah. She had the whole <laughs> yeah. she but a couple times got that after Yeah. She's got it now. It's even ready to hunter's mark. <laughs> okay. Uh so you guys cleared out these people. There's some tentacles over there though, be careful. <laughs> <laughs> All right, uh, same routine, uh, taking the uh, limbs the and retrieve my javelin. Are you going to roll too much door to go on? You're taking skulls and the spear? Uh, taking skulls and using the spears to prop the arms to show which direction. Okay. Did you? I wasn't paying attention. I mean, it was a while ago. I think we might have buried it. I'm sorry, but in that in the Facebook Messenger thing. Oh. Yeah. No, I think it's buried. It's like a couple weeks ago. Yeah. Uh, oh, did you guys get me down here? So the March order again was Scrub Nails Played. Big Play Inspector. Big Play Inspector. Okay. Uh, everybody roll for an initiative check. No change. No change. No change. Didn't roll a two this time. We got five for the Azir and sixteen for the final. <laughs> Mm 
You start again. Screw it. Um, we don't hear that many dudes. Okay. How far can I see the angle? Um, you probably gotta say right here. Oh, all right, but if I stand here, can I see more? Like, maybe I can see that. Uh, nope. There. There's only two? Yeah, there's only two. Okay. I suspect the floor is not stable. That's what I was just oh, thinking, yeah, too. Nice <laughs> <laughs> flat, just in case anybody else uh, drops the floor. Uh, okay, what's the nail play going to do? Uh, let's see. I've already burned my biggest spell. Are you feeling cold? <laughs> uh, considering that there's lava quite literally under our feet, no. Uh, I'd say we'll be in sixth, where I'm closest as I possibly can to Scroat. Oh. <laughs> And I will ready a sacred flame. Sacred flame. Okay. Yeah, I'm holding an elder splash by the way. Okay. Fire no elemental. Mouse. Fire elemental. Mm -hmm. I'm turning over here and set you on fire. Uh, Sacred Flame. Uh, Sacred Flame is the same thing. Uh, DC 16, that is... Ooh, dex. uh... That one's Dex Space? Oh, okay. Is it? Yeah, Sacred Flame is Dex. Okay. 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 Shit. How many damage did you do? 13. 13. Uh, he steps into your square, so, so you're on fire. And you take 7 points of damage. Now, I'm actually on on fire? Yeah, you're on fire. Shite. Do you want the specter to come put you out? Uh, yes, please. <laughs> Be flame. Yeah, can. The fire melon came yeah, flying up here. Three. And it's a touch attack. Please don't. <laughs> that can away? Is that? Yeah. How far did I move? So you uh, um, put your hunter's mark on him and then stab him twice. How many uh, things do I need? Squares. Good. You move. Okay. One, two, um, three, four, five. Okay. Would you like to go six? Mm -hmm. Okay, I'll just put <laughs> I did get an A, so I think my hands are some... I go with oh, last, don't I? Yeah. Nope. Well, I'll just let the enemies, yeah. Um, You're gonna put some more... You, um, you're just eating up them um, uh, smites, aren't you? I still have a level 3 left. Okay. So this is the last one I have out of level Level two or level one? Two. Level two is three Ds. Okay. There's another reason why I want to get lucky oh, here. Sixteen. <laughs> but the two I get to re-roll? No, I get oh. to re -roll. Oh, this oh man, I get the wrong one. Yeah, pull those out, count. And then all these drop, I guess. Five. Then we add. Six. 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 No, no, no. Are you sure? It's a 3-9. Does Tom say? Oh, does Tom say? No. And 13. But see, you what? got real close. You should add it up. <laughs> 51. I can't read that. I'm being too small. And I then mean, after replay. Hey, you got to move back one that way. Move back one this way? Or I'm not in the way anymore. This way? Yeah, I'm going to just add it. Okay. Out of the way. I don't want to be out of it. I want to yeah, be out of the way. Spectre flies up and. Tries to touch it. Spider's gonna go after the biggin. Yeah. Biggin. Yeah. Twenty-five. Yep. For twelve. 
And you take 10. Yeah. And then be five. And then, our Spectre comes. Okay. Okay. Run me up to arrow range, and I'll uh, shoot him. Four damage. Easy, easy. Yeah, 17. Ooh, minimum damage, though. That's 16 points of damage. 79. Shoot him again. Uh, 16. Okay. For 21 points of damage. 100. Good yeah, man. Do <laughs> and I did. Okay. Kills him. Then comes your rock. Go make him put him out. <laughs> <laughs> Put him out? Yeah. Alright. Druid craft, I think I can do that. Wait, you made it. Then the Azir. <laughs> okay. For some reason, I decided not to move diagonally. <laughs> Serve <Server> time. <laughs> Um, okay, so that right up there. Then it's back to screw. Okay. Uh, oh. I'm flying. So I have to. Oh, blast somebody. You're going to fly the whole time? Yes. All right. Because I heard there was only two of them. Okay. <laughs> but there's five of them. Yeah, I love okay. one. And then. No, but I will stay where I'm at. Ow. <laughs> I'm bad. And, and I will ready a uh, toll, toll the dead. Yeah, toll the so dead. Was first. Yeah. And you're going to shoot after he dies. Exactly. Okay. Yeah. And then. All right, I'll toll the dead. Be fine. Be fine. I'm just going to move back. Um, and you want to go up and like wait for him around the corner? Yeah, I just need to How many is that? That's six. Yeah. Alright. Couldn't yeah. I do that in a holding rack? Yeah, what do you want to hold on? I don't know. Um, Firebolt would be a bad idea, but anything like that? Uh, <laughs> no, I mean, I have the Spender Smite thing. I don't know if that's going to do anything. No, um, that's, that's, that's a problem. Yeah, you, you got a bow? She does have a bow to switch. I do have a cross. I have a large cross. Give a large, no, a light crossbow. I have your, I have a light crossbow. Yeah, yeah that's the user at the end Light crossbow, switch uh, to the crossbow. Are you going to see? Okay. Do you have this one? And then, the Spectre. The Spectre flies out. Mm -hmm. uh, I'm probably going to see. 50 fly. Go on straight after. That's 45. Ow. If he if if he if he survives, how about we have him check the thickness of the floor? Oh, good. <laughs> Last five feet. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but no, you can't because you stay there and take damage. Okay, then move again. <laughs> Just doing. fly like this. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Do that because it's you know, if you just go die, you know, okay. all right. Who's next? <laughs> Let's go there. Uh, move me up to the bow shot range. I just stand right here, right right now? Now? Uh, maybe you know, maybe stand behind him because he doesn't want to shoot through you, but you can shoot through him. Fair enough. We're right. We're right. Ready, right? Ready to shot. Okay. Screw it. Uh, I want to summon some pterodons. What are pterodons? The flying dinosaurs. Yeah. The winged. Yes, I do. <laughs> right. How many are they? Medium. 
So we need some medium flying dinosaurs. Let me check how. Spire. Big spire? Yeah, you did a purple. Yeah. Purple? You mean the red ones? I think. Oh, my God. oh those ones. I was talking about the cool ones with the legs. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. They're not purple, those are just gray. Are they? Oh, I'm thinking of the purple rats. Yeah, the flying snakes are no good against these guys because they get one shot and die. Are they in the troll box over here? No. Then the whole I should review my minis and then you mean like the you mean the gray spider? Yes, gray spider. How many pterodons can you to make? How many? Eight. Okay. Eight. Eight medium creatures. Let me see. Challenge rating four. Challenge rating four. Yeah, eight. They beat you guys through. Uh, they fly, <laughs> and they're medium, and we're small. <laughs> Problem solved. <laughs> What's the damage output? Uh, can one pick you up? Can one pick each of us up? Yeah, the medium, yes! That's why I summoned These the medium. These work out really well too, we just had to write on them. <laughs> okay, if we need large spiders that we need to write on, I can provide those. <laughs> I have no, ten of those. These are actually to pterodons. <laughs> <laughs> uh, they're I like to say the silent. <laughs> They're plus three to hit, two d four plus one piercing damage. They also have flyby. Oh, great. So where do you summon them, and how far do they move? Uh, they have a fly of sixty, but I think they're gonna probably hang back and just be our emergency, like. Uh. Oh Funny. shit, grab <laughs> the oh shit, grab It's the oh shit part. <laughs> <laughs> so you just spew out a bunch of pterodons <laughs> and go, hey, I just thought of this. <laughs> okay. Oh, Make them easy. I've been thinking of that. Yeah. Do you Sixteen. Alright, and then that's total dead? Yep. Uh, do I see him? Yep. Yes. Okay then. Uh, so, uh, Caden Grove. Wisdom. Oh, Wisdom. Wisdom, DC 16. Yeah. Didn't make it. Didn't make it? Okay. Really? Out of all the good rolls, this is the time I roll shitty. 10. 10. 26. <laughs> 20. Oh, he was next? Yeah. Here you go. Right. <laughs> Cause he's probably gonna kill this guy so you should the other. Shoot him in the face. Crit. Okay. <laughs> because his crossbow isn't powerful enough as it is. <laughs> Roll to see the second soul. <laughs> Alright. Then you can hit this guy with sandwich. No soul sucking. And six damage for you. Great. Oh, quick play mine. And then he can hit you. Oh, sorry. Can I hit Where you go? Yeah, you missed. Hello? Yeah, you missed. Real close. Cool Alright, the gear you said is total in the book half? Yeah. Should be a lot. This is just from one type of item. <laughs> <laughs> Should be a lot. Because that's why there was no gold. It was just like they're gonna collect up all the stuff and sell it. Salvage. We're gonna have him write it down now. Huh? We're gonna have no, 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 no. I'm gonna wait till I get everything together. He's telling you he's making the money back. Don't worry. With his salvage <laughs> routine. I mean, all the archers are dead. Very dead. So it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Uh, who's that? Why people need to know if they're if any of those cultists are women. <laughs> I'll be very happy if there are more women. He'll kill them. The Did Azir. Thing? Oh yeah, you were gonna jam on somebody, weren't you? No, like no. Cross, like crossbow. Oh, crossbow, yeah, crossbow that guy. 
I don't think I need to know. Well, you do, but... Oh, crap. Hold on a second. You need to get 17 in your apple. How many times are there again? All right. So that's the end of the round. You're the beginning of the round. I'm going to pause good at that. Talk about your stuff. Okay. Yeah, that's just from a hand crossbow. Oh, my God. Oh, I should summon these next time. Toilet paper roll looks like mine when the cats get to it. <laughs> it was kind of shredded. Oh. What? The, the, the toilet, toilet paper, paper roll, roll in the bathroom. Oh, the yeah, when, when the cats get to it. Yeah. Okay, guys. Holy oh, shit. I should have summoned these. Might have to hang the one in their room so that what? it rolls from underneath. Giant owls. <laughs> if it rolls over the top, they're They're like, large. large. We'll say you and I talk about it. <laughs> so you have to do it the wrong way. But, yeah, they keep rolling it until it goes off on the floor. Uh, <laughs> by that right now, sir. Yes. Do I have giant owls? Why don't I have giant owls? Some of giant owls next time. They're giant large creatures. Owls, giant owls. Huh? And they <laughs> understand <laughs> common and sylvan and elvish. And then we can say, fuck your four or four problem, I don't care. <laughs> I hang on to this big ass owl. <laughs> and I do have to remember if the humans were using heavy crossbows or light crossbows. I hope heavy. And there were 77 humans. Out of those 77, 20 had hand crossbows, so 57. Then, of course, the dwarves. The dwarves we know were using the heavy crossbows. Oh, well, they also speak giant owl. <laughs> That's a language that they know. They understand common elvish and sylvan, but can't Are speak you it. On the dog? dog barks if I come in the room. If I pet the dog, it just lays down. If I stop petting the dog, it barks at me. <laughs> it barks at intruders unless they want to pet it, and I'm an intruder. <laughs> Why can't I get a smart dog? Everybody's like, my dog's so smart, not mine. <laughs> I had a smart dog, but she got old. Uh, so it's up to you. Dump her out. Scrub. Scrub. <coughs> yeah, holy shit, these are like straight up. And uh, 22. Eight. Eight. <laughs> um, okay, who's it after? Uh, I'm really bad at walking. Neil's done. All right, uh, go ahead and move me forward six. Oh. Or, or, or wherever it was. That worked. All right. And toll the dead. 16? Yep. I didn't make it. All right. That's wisdom, right? Yes. Okay, 29. That is good. That makes it. That's what yeah. <laughs> I've, been rolling yeah. high, I've been rolling the minimum of 20 until I previous roll when uh, I roll 10. Uh, two. Yep. What are we going to do on these here now? <laughs> they last for two hours, I think. An hour? Two hours? Uh, we How long are we going to do it? <laughs> they're going to follow us around. Right. Why are they on? All right. Uh, so you do your random thing again? Or sure. Just go that way. Just go that direction. Okay. <laughs> yes. Yeah. <laughs> Which is this roll for what we come out of? Roll from where you're leaving. I asked you which door you're leaving. Which door? I mean, you roll a die. Yeah. So you're leaving on the sixth door. But do you have you been rolling to come back, or are you just taking my roll and take? No, then I roll again. Oh. I got a two. So then you come in the two door, which is over here. This is the final one. And that's why I asked what we're doing with all these pterodons. No. They'll fall behind us. Uh, this is very squishy, uh, barely five feet tall. He also puts ducking a little bit. Uh, ducking a lot, actually. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's lovely. So how are you going to line up there in the... I guess we're doing it in order of initiative? Yeah. 
Did you roll for the initiative for the tear down tent? I'm doing that now. Oh, sure. No change. No change. Another thing I need to have written down is there an issue? I have an extra one of these. You just want to do it for yourself. Oh, I've got a bump. Okay. <laughs> no change. I just I did I did yeah, this okay. one day. What are the diameters? What are this? this? So I have you know. Uh, that's what he's still working on right now. Initiative because it's at least fifteen. Fifteen diamonds? At least. At least. Five, one, okay. This is now section GG. Spirit, no, but. Seventeen. The diamonds just went after nail spike. So you're gonna put them in in here? So everybody else is way back here? I'm gonna put three of them there. That'll stack though. Okay. okay. Maybe need to, one of them. them. Then you just gonna put one medium one there. And if that's worse or better. And then to a crack and then you and the rest of your dinosaurs. They move fast? <laughs> Fly of 60. Okay. They can fly, but they won't be able to get very far from here. Oh, yeah, they hop, though, on the ground, right? 10 or something? 10. Uh, everybody did an initiative check? Yep. Oh, yeah. We're Not, no. Watch the fight a couple of these things. Can these things fly? No. No. Um, now they move across the ground. Okay. Okay. I am not upset by that. So, uh, <laughs> the fire elemental is 7 and the is there a 4. So, you guys are all going to go first. So, start with Kurt. What are you going to do? Uh, I'm going to run into that A room. I'm going to hold a polymorph. Just like that? I see the fire elemental kind of again. Polymorph. I didn't know we were doing that these days. <laughs> all right, then he comes down with it. I want to go right there. On the A itself? Uh, above the A. Above the no, 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 no. Torch. Sorry, torch. There you go. And I will ready a toll today. Okay. And then the uh, first pterodon flies out and clears out back, back behind them. Okay. Yep. And readies to catch someone. Oh, in case you fall. Okay. Then well, we play. It's probably there, and big guy there. Maybe six. That's part of making That's what it's doing. That's all you do. Yeah. You might want to get out of the way. Yeah. Well, that's kind of out of the way. It's going to be lagging into there if you want to. Hmm. But you just want to run all the way to get some help. No, I mean, if yeah. goes up. We can diagonal past you and you sit there. If the anything comes up with 10 feet, so I'm up, they come up right there. If it comes within 10 feet, you're going to stab it? Then I can get him? Yep. Uh, okay. I'll put mark on And the, uh, maybe we'll be able to put your mark on man's seven, so. Okay, I'll awesome. put the mark on your next turn. Uh, Spectre. Question about the left turn thing. Can you actually, like, pick up a. Like, you wanted to. Is it always on the life drain thing? Oh, or can you, know, like, grab a sentient thing and move it? I don't think you can move things down. Because he, yeah. Because he's in purple, right? So. Okay. <laughs> but he could, uh, you know, pass through it. Or stick his hand in it and drain life out of it. I don't want to do that. <laughs> okay. So where do we go then? Uh, Opposite side of the hallway. Five fifty. Oh. Yeah, that's 
still 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. So that's too far. Available in action. Double move. Okay. Double move there. Yep. Toe crack. Toe crack. 3, 4, 5, 6. Um. Yeah, move me over next to the cleric, I think. Cleric? Okay. Yeah. You go on the other side if you want. Um, yeah, the other side is probably better. That'll give me a better shot at the door. Then... Root rat. Uh, and... six. Yeah, I know. I'm trying to think of if I can move anywhere useful. Well, I mean, you can, down, you can right? move up and get out of the way of the uh, bugs. Yeah, yeah, I'll do that. Okay, anything you're ready? Oh, you're in control, sorry. Yeah. You guys both have control. All right, then comes the fire element. Yep. So now as we come over here, you're going to polymorph it. Make sure it gets a little bit closer. <laughs> this is the end of the hallway, and then I'll polymorph it. <clears throat> okay. Okay. Nobody else is holding anything. No. I'm oh, say I'm holding total dead, but I can't. Yeah, you would be able to see it. Uh, you move too many. Yeah, yeah you move too many. Now I just remembered this. Uh, can he be polymorph? I don't know. <laughs> or was, that's the goal right think. after you said. Is that the goal that I was looking at? Yeah, shape changers. Yeah, that was the goal. Are the bugs holding an action to move? No, if I can get a little bit. Better. Or yeah, probably, probably should have had him follow me. Oh, is there a really good action? Yeah. Oh. Not fully plotty. <laughs> Wait till everybody got out so they can move. Yeah. <laughs> we'll go with that. <laughs> Beef I can still run down. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's what I'm worried about. I mean, do it. Yeah. Does it work? Yes. Okay, cool. Uh, wisdom say, please. Wisdom say, number 17 or 18 or something? 18. Right. Thank you. <laughs> cool. So, nothing happens? I'm gonna turn him into a fucking turtle. You have to throw him down the chute. Get <laughs> <laughs> the crap out of here. Get the crap out of here. That would have been great. And they would just be like, we um, fire, then turn back on himself. Told it? Yeah. Oh, yes. Uh, so since no damage was done... You wouldn't really want to told it that turbo, but... No wild magic. No wild magic. Uh, so 16. Third... Oh, wait, that's wisdom, right? Mm -hmm. Yes. There you go. Failed. Third All right. Oh, he's turtle. Fine. Taking 16 points of damage. 16. And now he's wounded. Yep. And then come the Azir, right? Yeah. Ooh, there's an Azir, you can do that. Wait, did the Pyro Elemental do anything? No. They're supposed to move farther, wasn't it? It's gonna go in here and set the, uh... Spirit, spirit on fire? Set the Spirit on fire? For three damage? Okay. So one, and it's on, and it, you, it's on fire, and then he attacks you, and it's still fire. you still have cold on? Uh-huh. I'm just getting hit him. Six. It's only like 25% chance to hit. Uh, and then the Azir, and then back here. Yep, I'm going to have to go. Um, Wait a minute. Nope. He didn't get within 10 feet, sorry. Because he wanted to set that guy on fire. And just smack him twice. Okay. Uh, 21 is the lower. Yeah. So you just hit him twice and take the damage? Yeah. 13 damage. Okay. Uh, that doesn't take you on fire, right? No, I don't think so. Or if he moves into your... Yeah, 
If he hits you, or if you move to your square, if you hit him, 34. 34 damage. So that's 50 now. Help it. Okay. Uh, we'll toll the dead again. Okay. Actually, you know what? He's got 50 on him. I'll actually guide him both of them instead. And I will do this as. Fuck, I'll do it at fifth level. Okay. I don't know. Yeah, you got it. Yeah, I'll do it as fifth level. Alrighty. So. You have to roll the hit? Yep, I do have to roll the hit first. And you're plus two? To what you're normally plus? I'm done. Did you get a one? Yes, I did. <laughs> okay. All right, fifth level. Nice. Um, <laughs> think of the dinosaurs. Yeah, I don't know how to spell. To, to, to there, <laughs> I'm sure there's a random P in there. P is a P. It starts with P. P T Terry. P T Y E R. No. No. T no Y. R Y. No. No Y. Terry doesn't have a Y in it. Not this one. Both. P T E R A N. O D O N. I just see it. <laughs> Take three of them and move them against this wall, not the one behind us. So three of the line, and have them prepared to grab someone. And then, how many are in that hall? Four, right? Four. Yeah. I'll do four of them. Hit hit the fire elemental and back off. They do not take opportunity attacks unless you're the sentinel bullshit. Go. Nope. Draw the other door. So four attacks. Yeah. And I'm at plus three, I believe. How many hit points did I? Uh, twelve. That's why I'm letting them do it once. Because <laughs> they won't instantly die, like yeah. the no ropes. Thirteen. Mm. But they have to hit first. Yep. That's a miss. It's also a miss. Thirteen? Yep. Six. Six damage. And one last one. Nine for him. And a miss. So you get one tear done that has nine on our marked motor with mine. You play. You play. You need to step forward one to, to hit him in your lance. Okay. Hunter's mark? Okay, I'll have you. And Lance. And Lance. And can I do um, a mm -hmm. with the... Um, Divine Smite? Divine Smite, yeah. With Divine Smite? Oh, sure, I'll see. It's kind of a new hit. Oh, I don't know. It's a set of nine. No, no. It's 12. Nothing here. 12? Yeah, 12 minutes. Pull up your second tank and put the divine smite on that one. You just been thinking about. Uh, don't use your divine smite. You erase yeah. that mark. Uh, you don't have to use it if you. That miss. wizard's tower we found near Harlan. Mm -hmm. I've been thinking about it. Wait, because uh, the hall the hall still has the uh, link dog link dog in it. Mm -hmm. I think I finally figured out a way we could uh, bypass that. <laughs> okay. And, and <laughs> I'm just sitting over here because I'm like. It's better. Set a moment. Okay, uh, Spectre takes damage of being in the turn. Oh, it's gonna back into the wall first, right? So, you know. Then what'd you get? Uh, 11. 11. And you take some damage. 7, so I'm getting 3. And 11 for him. So 67 now. Oh, and I won't, like, I'll go, like, into the hallway. And you wanna be in the hallway and see? Yeah, that, you know. Okay. I'm not putting myself in front of Right. Uh, Tokrak. And you put your own fire out by going through the wall? Yeah. Okay. Tokrak's okay. gonna shoot him in the face. So, okay. 
We well, get in there, we get her. the door, mm -hmm. drive on in the hall. We go in, wherever the staircase <laughs> is supposed to start. Um, Stone machine to hit. Make an opening there. And then put like a, uh, a pull case or something there. Lock it. Put it on the hinge. Mm -hmm. We never have to go through that hall. Right, it's on every stair. Um, 16 to hit. So we have to go into the room. To go set or to go to the stairs. 19 points of damage. Who will now have to fly on the tail. I don't have that capability. This will be where Nail Split retires, just so you know. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm going to. With my, my, my throat is still. Move up so I'm lined way. up with the hallway there. Yeah, there we go. Kill these guys in a different day. Yeah. Um, Root okay. Rap. Root Rap. Anybody really injured? Uh, I've taken 17 points of damage, so. Vector, but. <laughs> I can't heal him. I'm right there. If you want to heal yeah. me, I'll, I'll take the healing. Alright. Yeah, I'll just Wait. pop the level one. Where are we healing the player? Why not? <laughs> Okay. What else am I gonna do? Else. <laughs> you got nothing else to do. Go for it. Seven. Seven. Okay. Still down by ten, but that's okay. All right, and the easier just run forward. Face off with the picture. I bought it. You bless him. I could heal the specter, but if you level four spell. <laughs> Negative yeah. energy. Negative energy. <laughs> Uh, 20 and a critical. Uh, 26. Oh, uh, yes, yes. And yeah. then nail start. Alright, total of dead on that gut. Well, actually, moving. Yeah, go over there and it's uh, cover no matter what. So. That middle spider. Middle one. There we go. Also, total of the dead is not. Hey, to hit. It's not to hit, so it's cover one man. Yeah. <laughs> Fail. Alright. Uh, that will be 19 points of damage, which should kill him. It kills him. Yep. And then? The dino. Oh, the How tall is the hallway there? Five feet. Because it's five mm. feet wide, so it's five feet tall. And I'll all just prepare to try to catch someone. Okay. And then be fight. You want to run through the specter? Um, yeah. So you can stand people? How far can I run up? I mean, yeah, I know how far I can run up. I mean, you can get right up in there. I'm going to put him afar. No, no you'll, you'll be, be right there. Away. You will take yeah. damage. You can either attack from this space, but then you'll be at disadvantage because you're supposed in there with him. Or you can just stand there and stab the first one that comes near. One stab. Or you can jump up there and fight him but take fire damage. I wouldn't do that. I was tempted to cast haste on you to be a machine gun. <laughs> but we keep wiping them out and I'm last. <laughs> we need to find boots for really speed for you. I'm not, that's not the, speed isn't the problem, I'm last on well, the... Well, though, boots speed for him. I'm just going to go to the other side of where these... Move up and happens. hold your action if it does. for it to move forward. But it does. Yeah. 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 She's going to go here and then stab the way he's far. No. So you want to go from here. Got it. Just in case he shoots in the back. <laughs> okay. I never miss. Straight here. Straight here. Straight here. Straight here. Front or back. Forward or backward. Or forward, then backward, or backward, forward. I move forward. I attack him. Okay. What is that ahead? Okay. Yeah, he does fire damage on the back. See if he's coming. Yep. Five. Yeah. Uh, 15 points of But 15 points of damage for him. No more spectrum. He was good while it lasted. 
He's fire resistant and weapon resistant. I like it. <laughs> Pretty good. Uh, uh, turn great. Turn great. All right. Shoot him in the face. It's a uh, a couple of them. Yeah, twenty-eight. 63 hit points worth of uh, targets for you. Alright. <laughs> That's a miss. Okay. <laughs> you always miss one. I know. Um, that's not 19 points to hit. 19 to hit. <laughs> and 20 points of damage. Oh, you're going to shoot him again. Okay. Um, 20 something. Hit it. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh. Can I three over and frostbolt someone? No, we can four and then two back. Yeah. Four but then I'll one. move one diagonal so I'm on the same row of script. Yeah. Uh, 15. Miss. Yep. Just ears. Then these ears. It's time to go and hit the B flame, but B flame gets to hit first. Oh, or not. No. Alright. No. One, two, three. Four. Hey, look, he doesn't hit you, does he? Nope. He needs to hit these guys. Yeah. So he runs up there and hits you. With her? Yeah, her. Mm -hmm. And that's 23. I think that's a hit, isn't it? Uh, um, 24. Yeah. yeah, you can't build that fire element. Yeah, this is 24. Yeah, yeah. Five. Yeah, yeah. Eight, 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 which is a miss, right? Yes. Mm -hmm. So the last one. And he gets a crit. Oh, shit. So you can't shield that one. I don't need another D8. Oh, that's worse for a 14. All right, tell the rest, go. Yeah. Who's faster in front of me? Right in front of you. I hit him. Hit him. Hit him. No, uh, 20, so. <laughs> uh, 15? Speed backs for 10. 15 for 10. And so you're back. 19. Speed backs for 8. Uh, 14 for 29. Who's next? That's what it made me. Uh, is that the only one that's been damaged? Or is yep, that that's the only one that's been damaged. You know, the first two are killed, but the others were on here. Based on your 3d12 on uh, 10 hit points. Well, we're sure he's dead, but... <laughs> <laughs> I told him really did. Actually, you know what? Do the one behind him. That's, I'll, yeah, I'll him that's exactly what I'm doing. It's just a 3d8. That's still oh, enough to work. Okay. He should be able to take out that first guy, yeah. and then and him have some take out yeah. the Okay, so uh, I got a wisdom save, right? Yes. Just 14, so that's a fair. That is a fair. Okay, uh, he takes 8 points of damage. 16 damage. Alright, so solve him up. The dinos. Why do I attack on the uh, middle guy? Um, For those four. Just these the four. rest of them are still standing by to save. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Sure. Just over right there. That's okay. eight. Up there. Six. It's a miss with a nine. 
19 on the die. Nice. Take. That one now has 12 damage. Out of 13, right? Mm -hmm. One in the corner there has nine. This one had three and eight. It had nine and just took three more. Did he? Uh -huh. Oh, you were keeping them. track of them? Uh -huh. Oh, okay. And then they lost them. Sixteen. Yes. On the die. Oh, no. oh, oh, the sixteen. Sorry, it's a thirteen plus three. three. That's a thirty for when you go to finish them off. Be glad. Be glad. You're standing right next to him, though. When it hit him and take the damage, or or what? Or hit him and take the damage. Or just stand there to attack you and you take damage. <laughs> yeah, I can probably take the damage. Okay. Um. Do you want to hit the injured ones or the uninjured one? Do I just hit the ones? Yep. Um. I'll just hit the damage The damage ones. Okay. Also, mm. how much damage? It's 12 here and 10 here. So 15 plus 9, so that's, yeah, that's, that's it. Yeah. I have 13 HP. And don't forget to put your yeah. hunter's mark on them. So do a D6 in there. And I'll do one on the other. No. I can't do that. I wouldn't. You're going to kill Because there's those two plus 6. Alright, 8 plus 6. Yeah. yeah, you did 14. 20. You needed 10. Okay. You did 14? Yeah. Well, no, plus, I did more than 14. Yeah, plus yeah. 6, so plus 20. Six. Yeah, you only needed 10, so you wiped him out. Go for the, well, he's going to hurt you, though. Three points damage. Then you're going to hit the next one? And then I'll hit the next one. Yeah. Same. Oh, no hunters mark this time. Mm -hmm. Oh, is that 15? So is it eight? Yeah. No, 17 is 17. So that's a miss. All right, then after replay comes straight back. All right. I need see. nine there. Um, I'm still going to shoot him for damage. <laughs> Just move these. I can't do that. If you move, they will hit you. Um, that's only 15. Yeah, I'll proceed now. Okay. You should save that, uh... Oh, shit. Oh, well, you yeah. missed anyway. Oh. So you should save that one-sided D20 you had. And use it just for your... I know, right? would be cool for your... All your maneuver dice. You mm -hmm. Double D20. And I missed the second shot. With a two. Just... Okay. Yeah. And then he fed them. <laughs> well, that'll kill him. I'm pretty sure, yeah. You want to just roll for, uh... Roll, uh, see if I suck this salt in? Yeah. Yeah. Oh! No. 17. No. Alright. There's one guy left, though. Rurat. Rurat. Can you kill this guy? He's 38 damage. <laughs> 39. Sorry, 39 damage. 38 with your bears. Okay, what are you going to put on? No, nothing less. I only roll on my superiority die that would miss with a 1. Do we not give you any crossbow? My rear cross does more anyway. Yeah. Okay. That was 2 yeah. 15 plus 8. Does that hit? 2d8? 10. 10? Yep. Okay. Azir. And then the Azir gets to hit B play again. Oh, you missed. It's great. I don't have to hit him twice. <laughs> there we go. Hit him twice. For 15. Give me back. 15, 16, 25. There we go. Did you hit him both times? Yes. 11 then. Didn't you say the first one was a crit? Yeah, I think yeah, it did. Yeah, I rolled you a one and a two. <laughs> uh, I didn't see you roll two. Uh, I saw him. 
Okay. If you okay. roll them together, then he rolled them together. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 14. That counts. That's exactly, exactly what you needed. <laughs> All right, so we got bugs with 10 and 12. All right. And we turn it out this level. And then we're in GG, I think. Yep, GG is what I got. Uh, GG, if you need to provide you all the uh, details, or do you want to wait for next session? We wait. We wait. wait. Okay. okay. I'll say, I will be here next week, so. No problem. <laughs> oh, actually, speaking, speaking of, let's say, it's September. Oh, right. say, yes. Yeah, okay. 26th. Is the one you're missing. Okay. Now, if I remember correctly, Halloween falls on Thursday this year. Yeah.